Good afternoon. Hey, how's it going, Seven Night Dark? Qualwar, Miyakutsu, Ren Ren, Shadow Destroyer. How's it going, everyone? Hello, Zell, Foxwind, Mathis. How many more Grails? Oh, well, hold on a second. Before I do that, let me just, uh, let me have the old third hand, uh, uh, mine away at, uh, the NA event. You know, while no one's looking. Don't worry about it. What's the pickle? What do you mean? It's perfectly normal. Hey, how's it going, CDN? Hellion, Kimio, AD88. We got to Bob. Coin toss, Asaniko. Got Teaspoon in the house, Alexiel. Moonshum is present. Jaltaria. Afternoon, lads. Hope you're all doing well here. Let's start the wager before I forget. Okay, uh, let's see. Will I get a gold servant in dailies? So, fair warning, I actually I accidentally did my one NA roll, so that's not going to be on here. But mistake and JP will be covered. So, Lael Crow, hey, thank you for the 30 months, Lael. Appreciate it very much. Hello, Matt. We got Echo Striker. Let's see, we got Chaotic Orpheus, Genbig, Sweet Neko, Dahonic, Kasukaito, Phazon, Aie. So, I actually went and I finished the base event at long last for, uh, for the uh, BB Dubai event. Celeb Summer Experience. And as you can see, this heart meter is looking a little buggy. How's it going, Manga Pyro? Hello, Zieri. But yes, it appears that I owe yeah. uh, BB some grails. Now, last time I, I didn't have enough embers, and uh, I don't believe that circumstance has changed because I was busy uh, farming Nikkei this week. <laughs> no, farming's not quite the right word for that game, but. Thank you for the 11 months, weird username. Almost a year? Yeah, dude, thank you for sticking around. Dude, I need to farm some more uh, embers and shit. It's okay, though. We'll start with what we got. Dude, I'm in fucking trouble. I'm in so much fucking trouble with this. Actually, hold on. Four star foes. Those aren't foes. Four star foes? These are foes. Okay. Well, gobble them up. You're gonna say it looks, it looks phallic. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'd say that's, um, yeah. I'd say yeah. that's on brand for the old beepster. Hello, hollow name. Okay, so my target is uh, level 108, and I'm currently at uh, 102. We got a little bit of work cut out for us. I mean, farming embers all day? Uh, <laughs> here's hoping that's not the case. But here, we can take care of a couple of things. So my main objective for today is actually to do Archetype Inception, which is the new ordeal called chapter that was gated by this event. Well, before we do that, we have to get our ducks in a row. Hey! Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, 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 uh, Captain, petition to, uh, permission to stop leveling BB. She's giving me weird looks. Hello, Oberon, and hello, Hilsigal. Deny, damn it! Oh! Also, how's it going, Fidel? Uh, Dr. Vox. Dude. 
do. People get get sour when showing videos of the new story. What the f what the fuck does that mean? Mm, what an Hello, Oni Squad. All right. Ah, make my beeb grow. Oh, Lipson, thank you for the 62 months, good sir. Just got here, which chocolate do I plan on picking? Well, listen, luckily for you, I already knew that was coming because I, I was looking some stuff up. But I'd be a little I'd be a little cross <laughs> if I wasn't already aware of that. Considering this is a stream to uh, you know, start playing that. But the answer is I'm probably gonna take um I'll probably take uh the female Akano. Because Dude Hakuno reminds me of Last Encore. Assuming there is a choice, and it's not like you could have both kind of deal. Too many bad memories? Yeah, exactly. Oh, the other gets added to friend points? Oh, it's no biggie then. Do I seriously not have any foes? Holy shit, I must have used up all my gold foes. What the fuck was I using them on? Ah, hello, Patch. Oh, never mind. I was on the I was on a filter. That's why. Oh, I still don't have that many. Jesus Christ. Let's see. Patch Mac, thank you for the 10 months. Eating a burger with no honey mustard! Ooh! Is Cunny Mustard like the evil version of uh, the, the Tubby Custard? Sounds horrifying. Anyway, I it's okay. So we need to first get a little bit of... Uh, we need to get some Ember action going on. But that, I can wait until we take care of our main agenda. I did get the grill from the event, though. So let's see... We would need 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, so we need 8 grills. We have 7. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh no, no, I only need 8 if we hit 120, there's no way that's happening, I'm safe. I'm fucking safe. Nah, no worries. Nah, we're, we're good. I mean, I wonder if the... I'm sure I'm sure um, Archetype Inception has a grill. Whether it's available now is uh, is the question, but we could always just do that. Anyway. Okay, so what is this? This is a 3-1-1 Berserker node. Oh, that seems trivial. Hold on. Let's see what we want to do here. No, wait, I'm not going to fall for that again. Wait. No, that's a Castoria. <laughs> this son of a bitch. I'm going to... Uh, listen. Remember this, chat. This man is a criminal. Would you like me to in help incentivize some ember farming? If I say no, will that stop you? Oh wait, you know what we could do? Hold on. Yo, chat. Let me show you the power of the gong. Hold on. So we're gonna run one copy of the event CE. Or the point CE, I think? No, wait. So he should run the three-star CE. Then we run uh, Scotty with the four-star CE. Oh, 
Oberon with the three star CE, and then we have a free slot. I'm probably gonna go mash with the point CE again. I mean, we could just combine the point CEs at this point, huh? Maybe I should. You know what? I'm gonna do that. Cause I'm probably gonna need to actually run the other CEs to farm. So I'm gonna combine the point CEs. I think that'll be the that's the play here. No, you know what? I accept this challenge. I'm not gonna pussy. I thought about begging for mercy. No, I'm not gonna pussy out. Hold on a second. One, two, three. Oh, there's no fifth copy. Shit. Hold on. Okay, so I gotta get the fifth copy from the ladder, probably. So maybe I should run pointsies until I get it? But anyway, yeah. So I'm not gonna pussy out. Fuck me up if you dare. Tell you what, I'll, I'll double down. I'm trying to make an announcement. Fido he... Tyson is a bitch-ass motherfucker. He cursed all over my fucking oh. wife. That's right, he took his stinky streamer curse out and cursed all over my waifu. And he said his wallet was this big. And I said that's disgusting. Oh, thank you for the 58 tier 1 subs to Hanuk. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Thank you very much. Alright, well, hold on. You know, should I say it? You, you, you. You pulled the trigger before I, uh, I, I threw down the gauntlet. Now I'm scared. <laughs> yeah, hold on, let me, let me make a note. Oh, God. Yeah, I was gonna say, you know what, fuck it, I'll commit, I'll double down, I'll triple down. I will stay here and stream as long as it takes to, f today, for today only. Meet the quota. Whatever, whatever target level BB is at, except maybe 120, depending on um, how deep I get into Archetype Inception. I will sit here and I will farm all the embers it takes to get there. I'll fucking do it. Okay, so we need to hit 1.7 to get the point. Wait! At 1.7, we get the final copy of the point CE? But the letter ends at... What the fuck? All right. Oh, that's kind of scuffed, isn't it? I didn't think they'd do that. Okay, anyway, let's do this. So it's four, 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 four three, five, five. Yeah, in that case, instead of running the other Durga, see, I'm gonna run two copies of, um... I'm gonna run two copies of this, for the time being. I think I have off of work all next week since we'll be here a while. God damn! Also, Oberon, you want a Curse Catalyst? Sure thing. Oh! Hello, Fabulous23! We got Gek. Zero Herrera. Well, yes, welcome one and all. Sorry, I've been, I've been, I have a concussion from uh, all the subs that hit my face just now. Let me turn down the line for this a little bit. It's a bit loud, isn't it? Oh yes, it's time for us to spin the wheel, isn't it? What's the Fino slash Zerk Radio? So, okay, hold on. So, Zerk Radio is oh, subscribers pick the music for the stream. Uh, Fino Radio is I pick. Oh, sorry, not I. The the uh, the royal the royal Fino picks the music. 
Okay. Can I deal 500,000 damage? You know what? I'm not going to take that chance. Okay, I just have to hope that Chengong refunds 20%. Okay, so with Castoria, we actually do a round by. Okay, so we need overcharge to make that work. Good to know. Ooh, we're short. Okay, that's a problem. That's a problem. So I probably need to run my own Castoria and have her uh, with starting charge. <laughs> Help! Help! Alright, it's fine. You saw that Discord was moving that, but you couldn't find any specifics on the rules. So there's a pinned post in the Buster Brave Club, which is the channel accessible. But yeah, if you want to know the general process, so how we do movie night is holy shit, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get slaughtered. Okay, uh, so Chengong has a bit of a refund issue with this fight. That's unpleasant. So we need to overcharge on turn two, definitively. I don't much like that. But yeah, the, so the idea is we use this website called SideTube, which essentially lets us sync the same video file. But because I use Google Drive for the movie nights, um, there needs to be like a user script that you use. Like there's this program called Tamper Monkey, and on top, like within Tamper Monkey, there is a separate Google Drive user script, which is what makes the thing work. So that's the TLDR. And what happens is that once you get all that stuff running, I every Thursday I, I send out the uh, the password to get into the lobby for it. That's generally how movie nights work. My BBC is kind of beefy for some odd reason. <laughs> You're gonna make me beeb? Fine. I'll accept your challenge. The beeping will continue until morale improves. So I'm gonna be super aggro on this one. Let's run double Castoria, just to make sure it all goes to plan. So we got double Castoria, we got Oberon, we're gonna be running a swap on this one. I don't know if the charge amount's gonna work out without me using the uh, event damage CE, but we'll see. Okay, so that's Oberon, we have him as the swap. Uh, for when things invariably go to shit. So, when it goes to shit, who's my backup? Okay, let's slot in CL for the time being. Okay, then we got Mash, and she can run another 5-star CE. So that's 5543. Yeah. That's a big beep! And he got you today? We'll see. Now, right now, I'm just prepping for the daily roll. Oh, yes, thank you, Genbig, yeah. We have actually, we actually have, like, uh, a chatbot in the server. 
And there's a self-assigned role that I ping for the movie night. I believe the rules channel on the server has some details. I don't know if it has all the details, but it has some. Okay, let's fucking go. This is to be further beyond! Ah, uh, Johnny Boy, how's it going? Thank you for the 28 months. How you doing? Holy shit. That's a lot of beep. You know what the craziest part is? This, I, these enemies are the worst, because if you fuck up and you whiff the kill, they will purge your buffs. It's the actual worst. Oh god. How much charge do we have? Or how much charge do we end that NP with? That's not good. Okay, yeah, I need to use this. I should use this. I shouldn't save that. We can try this again. We can try this again. We'll make it work. Okay, I'm gonna try just weaving with no Castoria NP. Hey, how's it going, Molly Breath? Is Yellow BB good? I'd say she's pretty solid. Yeah. She's got that sort of dual use thing going on. Where you could run her as a support if you really want to. Okay, BB cannot single core this. That's okay though. It's just Beowulf. We need a 120 right now. Oh, that would fix it, wouldn't it? Actually, wait, you know what we could do? It's really dumb, but I have an idea. <coughs> <laughs> oh no, I can't! That's right, CL needs her face cards. Shit. Actually, you know what? I'm kind of curious. We should try it anyway. I'm, I'm sure it'll be funny. Use a CL BB loop? I'd rather not run CL as my main DPS. Or, sorry, I'd rather not run a Summer BB in my frontline. Well, maybe we could. Actually, you know what? It'll be funny. Let's give it a try. So we go Seeb, the Seeb combo. Yeah, why the fuck not? Oh, that's right. Before I forget, let's spin the wheel. Okay, so we have two goals left in the standard wheel. Oh god, I need a hold on note to self. Uh, make a bonus wheel for the month. Okay, so we got... Oh my god. Okay, so our next two goals are... Always Sunny and Jackbox. Let's spin. It's always sunny. Aw, 
shit. It's always sunny in Caldea, exactly. Uh, sub goal, sub goal. Sub goal. Hey, how's it going, Summer? Okay, so it's 561. So let's see. So that's um, 640, I think. Yeah. That's a week from now, which is the 29th. There we go. Oh, they're misaligned. What happened? Hold on. <laughs> I just noticed. <laughs> what the fuck? Was this like that the whole time? Oh, please don't tell me it was like that the entire time and I just didn't notice. Come on. Jesus Christ. Anyway, I have an idea. No, that wasn't intentional. I, that, I just didn't realize. Okay, so let's say we run CL. Which is a terrible idea for the record, but uh, one that I could do. So we go like 1CL. Actually, no, we should go like CL, Koi, and Oberon if we're going to do this. So we go Koi in first, then we swap Oberon. We swap Oberon in and have him idle. I think that's the play here. So that is BB has 50% charge. She has 50% battery and she has. This is 30% charge, right? Does this thing even give starting charge? Hold on. I feel like a lunatic. It does not. Fuck. Do any of these fucking things give starting charge? I mean, this does. But that defeats the purpose. Wait. Summoning campaign. No, that's NP gain. Shit. Okay, so we have to do this without starting charge. That actually makes things quite a bit more complicated. Hmm. So if I somehow get Summer BB's uh, second append, that's like 70%. Uh, right? We get another 20% from Oberon. So I'm missing 10. I'm missing 10 and I need to swap. That's a problem. Does CL give any kind of party charge right away? No, she has a bunch of self batteries. Shit. And delayed batteries. MP6 summer beeps? I do. But MP6 summer beeps does not actually fix the issue with her uh, starting charge. Because none of the events they use except for the damage one give starting charge. So I think the Summer B plan might have to go kaput. However, we do have an alternative. Arquade? Yeah, Arquade's not a bad idea here. So we run Arquade. She can use whatever the fuck. Then we run CL. Yeah, we run CL. She uses the... Dergacy. I guess, yeah. This means we won't get any kind of luck, but that should be okay, I think. Ah, uh, we'll see. I suppose we're gonna find out the hard way.
Okay. So that's our main roster, side roster. We could run the old Beebster, the old Master. Yeah, there we go. Seamless. Okay, well, let's find out, I guess. We're so fucked, dude. What is this final boss, even? It's Beowulf. Does Beowulf have exploitable traits? Chaotic. He's chaotic. He's chaotic earth attribute. Yeah, chaotic and earth attribute are the relevant ones. Male. Ah, I mean, we could use that. Okay. So we do this. Let me just make sure I have my ducks in a row. Yeah, so we use CL's skill 2. Quaid skill 1. Actually, wait, anti chaotic? Maybe we could just run our Quaid. We should try that. We should try mono our Quaid next time. But before we do that, here, let's uh, settle this. So our Quaid charges up. That happens no matter what here. And then next turn, we do this yell combo. We're not getting enough CDR for, to refresh this. We get one application, so we should just be careful. Okay, let's find out. As an arc friend, you'd say do it. You know what? Sounds like a good idea. Oh, that's very interesting. Okay, so now we get our Quaid out. For Oberon. Okay, let's see how much damage this does. Whoa, okay. Damn. That's pretty fucking good. Okay, so we could run a we could run a CL hybrid team. As long as our Yeah, as long as our first turn attacker has a hundred percent battery, we can do it. Yeah, and CL's guaranteed face card for the third skill. Very interesting. I mean, if I want to charge Max, I should do that team. Oh, you haven't seen the Nekoark variant? I mean, I feel like it's the common version. Like, uh, I think people said the serious version of the NP is actually rarer. Statistically. It's pretty funny. Okay, now let's try the Arcade. Uh, yeah, the Arcade variant. Okay. 
Get out of here, Alco. We got business to take care of. Okay, so we, yeah, we just do double Oberon. Uh, double Oberon. Jesus, God forbid. Uh, double Koi and single Oberon. There we go. And because I have our Quades append maxed out, we should be good to go. Yeah, append four is the crit one. That's the only one we're missing. Have you tried Kiara yet? Nah, I haven't. I haven't gotten the chance to uh, get her buffed up. Just quite yet. Although I hear she actually does damage to something now. Which is pretty good. She has always been a bit of a potato, so... It's good to see Kiara getting some buffs. Just happens to be a potato with a lot of utility. Which depends on am I gonna give CL? That's a good question. I'd have to double check, but I feel like the one I'd want to go for by default is the uh, CDR one. I don't know if the CDR actually matters for CL. She's got like, what, six turns? Six turns, six turns, and six turns. So five turns if it's... Actually, yeah, no. I think it's worth it. Because if we use all of her skills on turn one, we can get them immediately back on turn two if we need them. Which might be useful for like uh, boss stuff. Ah, thank you very much, Kaze SSB, for the 52 months. How you doing? Oh, God. Okay, turn two is a problem for this. And I don't think it's a problem that can be fixed by us swapping Oberon in. Beowulf, though, should be easy enough. Behold, the power of our Quaid. Catching up on the SHSR story and grinding out the event. Oh, grinding out this. What is it, DNA event? Yeah. Might take you a little while. But hey, the prize is pretty good. Okay. So, this is weird. So, we shat on the first and third wave. So, that second wave, that 500k sort of flying dragon thing is a real problem for this strategy. Man, uh, um, what is it? I don't believe the man attribute is relevant because Beowulf is Earth. The Oberon NP up, we were out, we like we were missing a lot of damage. Like we could try running everything. And see what that does. Well, everything except for ending of dreams. But I feel like we we've just um it's just not practical with my current setup. So probably the most practical thing we've gotten so far is the CL strat. Although I'm sure if I really wanted to, I could Kukul con this. Maybe I should. Google Khan should be able to do it with 50% charge. The problem is none of these events sees gift starting charge. Hmm. Only the damage one does, which effectively makes it not a six slot. Now, if we use Google Khan, she'd be about 30% short, I think. Ah, what a shame. Well, let me check something.
I mean, there are anti-chaotic servants we could use, but I feel like a lot of them are kind of overkill for Beowulf. There's Medusa's. All right, let's go. Here, we'll try using everything. Everything that isn't um, strictly essential for next turn. Which means Oberon 3 stays where it is. And aside from that, we just go for it. Oh, I don't think that's enough. <laughs> Fuck. I mean, we lucked out. We lucked out, but that's not great. I think the only way I can get this any higher is if we start leveling up one of the event damage CEs. Or not the event damage CEs. One of the event CEs for more damage. But again, that's overkill, so I'm probably gonna hold off on that. Anyway. Yeah. But we did find a functional 90 plus plus uh, 6 slot team, so I'm gonna just run with that. So let's put that aside. And let me grab some more embers. Crumbs. I'm fighting for crumbs here. I'm gonna incept in due time. And by in due time, I mean shortly. I just want to do the challenge quest first, but let us take care of this while we're here. So these are the faces of evil. So 41% of you think I'll get a gold servant in daily rolls. 59% think I won't. Let's find out. Aw, oh, shit. Hold on. Oh, that's right. I also owe a curse catalyst. I'm scared about that, too. Oberon, are you here? Here, we'll take care of uh, two birds with one stone. You thought the thing, the meter below the BB was a penis? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, how's it going, Trungmai? Rolling for Kiara? I'm rolling for uh, my daily rolls. My daily pulls, even. Ah, uh, you know what? Here is... Here's my shroud. There we go. Perfect. Shit, it's not perfect. There we go. いや、何か物入りかな。で、税収席の購入ありがとう。とても貴重なものだ。一気に使う。ああ。ほら。いや、let's <笑> do that. No, not the balance. Okay, hopefully this works. Oh my god, what's my password? Fuck me. Give me a second. There we go. Is that Jufu? That is correct. Alright, let's go. Pretty good read, by the way. Ah, oh, Archer MD, you're building Gumpla, huh? Oh, which model? Alright, no luck on spin number one. Let's go. Another one. 
pay good money for this. Turn gold! Turn gold! Turn gold! Ugh. More arcades, please? Come on, give me KP. Super Robot Wars, original generation. Oh, the Cybuster. No, nothing's turning gold. This is awful. Turn B. Turn, Bonzi, buddy. When I'm rolling for it, these are daily rolls. Nah, it's Lu Bu. Damn it. Okay, what do we have left? We have CL and Karna. Okay, well, I mean, our Quaid wins. No, no luck. We have one more shot. All right, now we got to go over to Mistake. Oh, fuck me. Sorry, I had the volume up for that one. All right, let's go. It's okay, we'll summon victory. No, it's okay. We'll summon victory this time. Hey, boss, did you got Dearman on the NA Daily? Does that count as a win for the Believers? No, it doesn't. That was, that was actually from a day ago, but it was like close enough to the lip roll that I was like, I don't want to post both at the same time. Yesterday's, I can show you what I got on NA, it's not pretty. Hold on. Uh, I have to hide a bit of evidence first. Give me a second. I have to put the third hand away. No one must know. Why is this so loud? All right, whatever. Here, we'll do this. Yeah, I've been uh, having the third hand do a little bit. What's BB's level? So BB is 103. She's level 103, and I still need to get to 110. Oh, I meant to use this last turn. Oops. Oh, no matter. There she goes, Timber! Yeah, she's one of three, and Chongmai, I, I threw down the gauntlet earlier to chat. Whatever the quota is for BB's level, I'm meeting it today. I will sit here and farm embers until the cows come home, if it comes down to it. If it comes down to it. Anyway, let's check. Oh yeah, this is what I'm working with in terms of uh, dust. I only really started hard farming yesterday, so I was slacking off. But yeah, I can show you guys what I got on the daily. 
As you can see, this one already happened. My summon history for yesterday is... That is Magoroshi Shinji. Or Marugoshi Shinji. So as you can see, no hope for the believers. I'm kind of making an announcement. Fino Tyson is a bitch ass. No, what is this? He cursed all over my fucking wife. No! That's right. He took the stinky streamer curse out and cursed all over my waifu. And he said his wallet was this big. And I said that's disgusting. Oh my god. Oh my god. Chongwei's gifted 80 tier 1 subs. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Thank you very much for Jesus Christ. All right, hold on. Let me let me adjust the count. So now I have to get BB to 112 today. Oh god. Oh god. Oh man. So that is a no. I did not get a gold servant on dailies. Okay, oops. Hold on. So yes, with that said, let me uh restart the third hand and let me return over to FGO JP here tell you what chat while I get everything settled up and established how about we uh how, why don't we why don't we do a little a little gamba attention a little gamba. I am Doberman <gasps> former military instructor for the Bolivarian Armed Forces now let's cut to oh the chase my God. hand over the list of operators in need of training Thank you for the 5,000 bits, Mystic! Damn! Rallying to the cause of the Why Done It, I see. Thank you very much, good sir. Alright. So we have one goal left on the wheel, and that is. Hold on, let me pull it up. It is Jackbox here. Let me spin it for shits and giggles. Sub goal. No, spin wheel. It is Jackbox. <laughs> Naturally. I mean, it's either going to be Jackbox or the white line. So now I got to come up. I got to come up with. Uh, you know what? We'll, I'll come up with a bonus goal while I'm farming for uh, Biebs. How about that? It's Jackbox. Let's go with. Uh, sub goal, sub goal. Actually, yeah, while I set that up and also the third hand. Let's Gamba. Which banner should we go in, guys? Uh, my Arcade's already super maxed out, so I'm good on that. And so is my Beebs. No, I don't need to go for either. <laughs> I'm good! I have plenty of Moon Cancers! Let me show you my spare Moon Cancers. Oh yeah, I actually got my first, uh... Dude, it's my second ever Passion Lip! So I posted a roll... ...earlier in the week. This is my second ever Passion Lip on this account. This was all way back in the Suzuka goes in disaster. That was when I rolled that first one. Holy shit. Okay, let me let me do a little inventory. Okay, so that's my NP6 B. We have BB NP6. Do we have our Quaid NP6? Let me check. You don't give this account lip passion? Oh, you. Okay, hold on. Let's scroll down to the Moon Cancer section. Okay, we have Arcade. That's NP6 Arcade. So the only one I'm missing is CL or Go. I'm putting any rolls I put go into CL. Oh! Thank you, Mystic, for the 4,000 bits! Ah, seizing fourth place, I see. Third place, sorry. I'm mixing my numbers here. Seizing third place, escaping fourth place. Alright, chat, let's go. CL, one time. Easy. Oh, 
That's a fucking throwback and a half, Nathus. Jesus Christ. Thank you very much for the 1,000 minutes. How do I juggle different accounts poorly? Uh, through panic and struggle. The TLDR is that once you establish a few oh my god answer a medical intern I'll be assisting with surgery and internal medicine among other things I look forward to working with you finally thank you Rapus but yeah the TLDR is that once you like sort of figure out what teams are good for generalist farming oh it's Jufu hey the catalyst worked guys Very nice. <laughs> what was I saying? Shit. But yeah, uh, the, the TL there is to figure out which teams like um, let you quickly farm everything and just sort of grind away at it. That's how you manage multiple accounts. What you don't what you want to do is you want to avoid a situation where you're just like face carding everything very, very slowly. So figuring out how to get like a good a good fast farming setup on a budget, that's the key. And thankfully, Mistake has been extremely lucky and also uh, fortunate enough to get every meta support. So I can actually just use Chen Gong when uh, all else fails. And also, we do have an NP5 summer com. also we failed. Let's go again. Oh, no, I refuse to give up. Uh, proceed, Mathis. Thank you for the thousand bits. I'll be assisting with surgery and internal medicine among other things. I look forward to working with you. Wait, 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 wait. Congrats on the 114 BB. We're not there yet. We're not there yet. Always Sunny was 112, right? Am I going crazy? Chat. Chat. Help. Oh, it means he's going in soon? Oh. Uh-oh. Hold on. Hold on. Let me at least set the goal. Do, 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 do. Okay, so it's 642. Check log Zerk Royale. And that's 720? Yeah, 720. This ends on the 29th. Oh my god. Oh my god. Twitch is giving you alerts because you never used 1k bits at once before. <laughs> God, I gotta come up with a bonus wheel! Oh shit! Oh shit! Uh, da, 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 da. Oh my god. Need my notepad. Three. Two. You know what? Here's one for Skip Gang. Boom. Let's see if Skip Gang's got the magic. No, it's got Karia. That's not magic. That's like the opposite of magic. Oh, so how's it going, Kerb? I, dude, that Durga looks like Altera, I swear to God. Except Altera's got short hair. Alright, you know what? One more. Unomas.
at everyone. Please oh, do not no! announce the server when you're going to masturbate. This has been a recurring issue, and I'm not sure why some people have such oh, yes! underdeveloped social skills that they think a server mostly full of high clothes <laughs> would need to know that. No one is going to be impressed to give you a high five, especially considering where that hand has been. Oh I my don't god. I want to add what? this to the rules since it would Wait. be embarrassing for new no, users to see we have a problem with this. It's going to be enforced as oh, a rule from now on. If it occurs, you'll be warned. Then additional occurrences will be dealt with at the discretion of the Sakura 5. Thank you. Congrats on 114 BB, boss. Holy shit. Thank you to Hanek for the 25,000 bits. Congrats on 114 BB. Yes, thank you very, very much. And. By your grace, you have channeled my NP6CL into existence. So I, I believe I have NP5 or 6 of every Moon Cancer except for Kiara now. On this account, it's crazy. This is like the Cancer account. But thank you very, very, very much, the Hanuk. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. What a bit sound to me. And I done it. <laughs> True. True. Okay, hold on. Craft Essence. Can you change it right now? No, other Kiara. Other Kiara. I'm gonna unlock that class score. Oh, yeah, dude. Once Moon Cancer... Once I get access to the Moon Cancer class score, I'm doing it. I'm pivoting. Like, I've been on Caster for a while, but I'll do Moon Cancer. In a heartbeat. But it ain't for BB. It's for our Quaid. That's my uh, Sundari answer, evidently. Okay, now then. So we have a couple of things to take care of. Let's do the challenge quest real quick. And you know what? Let's do it with the Beeb. Yeah, we got a lot of things to take care of today. Uh, so I will do something to avoid any spoilers and whatnot. I will, uh, well, actually, not to avoid spoilers. But to save some time, I'm going to be skipping all the text in Ordeal Call 3, which uh, is totally different from what I would have done anyway. We're listening to this challenge quest, doesn't matter. Have B. Oh, yeah, Oberon, now that you're here, take this. This is your Cursed Catalyst. It just I just realized they misspelled virgin on this. Who the who the fuck wrote who the fuck translated this? They need a proofreader. Oh chat. Any Nikkei players in the house? I have a sneak peek at the new anniversary character. It's a familiar face. You could say it's two of them. A look at an alternate timeline. <laughs> Sneaky hood, exactly. Okay, anyway, let me uh, grab a little something. You know what? In the unlikely event this uh, ruler poses an unsolvable issue. Let's throw in... You know what? Let's have uh, Raiko. Or, sorry. Ushi Gozen. Jump in on it. Not a big fan of Neon's ass, I understand. Neon is an acquired taste. Listen, her brilliance is uh, unknown until she gets to the grill. Okay, how am I gonna do this? 
Let's run. You know what? Let's do this, just in case. Whatever. Alright. We'll scout out this fight. I have no idea what the mechanics are. Oh yeah, chat, for anyone who missed it, I've actually gone and made a super catalyst folder where I've put every cursed catalyst. Well, I'm currently putting every cursed catalyst that I've ever collected into a single folder to, uh, a, a, to achieve true randomness. So if any of you want to fish in there for a new catalyst, let you let me know. I got some good ones. Ah, you suck! No, I suck! Thank you for the 100 bits, Mathis. The short answer is yes. Although now that you put it that way, that's a little horrifying, isn't it? Caesar King is coming out for ZZZ. You know what's funny? I could swear there is a Yu-Gi-Oh card called DDD King Caesar or something like that. So my brain like was turbo scrambled for a second. But yeah, you know what? You got it, Mystic. Let me go into the folder. Uh, here's what you got. Heavy aid, cat girl. Wave King Caesar, that's the one. I'm a bone to pick with that card. Is this Dark Rounds? No, this is the Summer Rounds. Wait, it's her! Formerly known as the worst servant in Fake Grand Order. You know what? Let me do this. Formerly, yeah, because, um, unfortunately, a man by the name of Yamanami Keisuke exists. So, because of him, Gareth is neither the worst four star nor the worst four star saver. Oh, either that's time-based, or that buff is based on the number of allies Gawain has. It's very strange. Okay, let's do this. You know what? This will make my life a little easier. Let me just do it this way. Oh, we got a couple of catalysts here. Let's take care of those. So I have no idea what makes this a challenge quest. Because I'm kind of just brute forcing through everything. Yes, okay, so we got Mystica Catalyst. That was the challenge quest for a new account? Maybe. All right, let's go. Let's 
Also, yeah, you should see some of the shit in this folder, Soma. It's like... This goes deep. How many reverse AI Tamamos? Um, fewer than you dread, but more than you would expect. There are at least two AI Tamamos in here. Well, only one's actually AI, but one is a derivative of AI Tamamo. Excuse me, why is this Gawain fellow not dying? Maybe there's some sort of condition that I need to meet to get rid of that block. Or that just remains. And like the first stack is the only one that really needs to go away. I got this. Still a little sad that they don't actually bring in the armored version of Ushigo. Oh, fuck! Okay! That was just the door boss, huh? Holy shit. Oh, we got a problem. We got a fucking problem. It is a fake enemy count, you're right. She fucking hurts? <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, we have to do this again. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run Ushi goes in from the beginning. I feel like one of those attack lines was different from the others. Is she purging buffs? It's ominous, isn't it? Okay, so we probably need a single target Avenger. We need to run AoEs with a single target Avenger. That's my thinking. Alright, this battle's a wash, so uh, let's see. 72 to her will. Here's your catalyst. Socialist? Oh, I don't think I have Kagekiyo on this account. Maybe I do, but I feel like I don't. Dante Stunlock Time? My worry about using Dot like uh, new Dantes is that he is um, single target. I feel like running an AoE is the way to go on this one. How's it runs on the quest? Uh, I'm getting kind of massacred by the challenge quest. Yeah, 
We're all dead. All right, here you go. 72 at your will. Seven out of ten successful people do this every night. <laughs> all right, Zieri, your turn. Oh my god, what is this? Here you go, Zieri. Lower the price? Get out of my store! So thank you for the 50 bits, Mystic. And I got sideswiped by Saber boat, Saber's boat. I did, I did. Capitalism? Oh! Okay, so 114. That's the correct number, right? For the whodunit. Yeah. Okay, met on... No, it's not who done. It's the why done it. Silly me. Because we started at 108, 10, 12, 14. Yeah, so we should be at 14. I'm cheating and requesting a pro tip. How do I beat the Guda Guda challenge quest? You don't understand the gimmick? Oh, so here's the idea. Here, let me show you. Um, yeah, I don't mind taking a little jump over to main. So there's two ways of doing it. I'll uh, tell you about the slow way. So the idea is that you need to keep hitting EO. And every time you hit EO, um, or she accumulates stacks of uh, lucky buff or like a lucky trait. And she also gains this when she attacks you. And when you get enough of these traits, uh, EO sprouts like a tree. Or it's, it's, it's a tree monster, but it's like a, a tea leaf metaphor. When you get enough of these for one turn, she loses her defensive buffs. And you have a chance to just do crazy damage to her. So you want to keep an attacker ready to just sort of destroy her for a th first health bar. But your team also needs to be fairly robust because they need to actually stay in the ring with EO for a while. That's the slow way of doing the fight. That's the intended way of doing the fight. And once you break her first bar, her second bar is like super weak. Just make sure you don't run any protection effects on the turn that you break her bar because she will steal your defensive buffs. There's also the fast way of doing it, which I could show you. Hold on. Fast way is a little, uh, it's a little involved. I think I can recreate it. Yeah, it's a little difficult, but you can actually brute force it. Okay, so this is the team. Oh wait, no, we don't run that. We run a Merlin. Oh, shit, hold on. Hopefully there's one that has his Bonsky. That would be ideal for me, but there's no guarantees. Ah, there we go. But yeah, the idea is that EO has a bunch of defensive effects, but they aren't foolproof. And one of them is a defense buff. And Kintoki can actually ignore defense with his NP. And with enough firepower, you can kind of like churn through the rest of her health bar and force her into phase two where she is vulnerable. But the idea with this team is that with Kentoki's NP and a single Kentoki Buster card, we actually have enough firepower to destroy the bar. I just need to remember to use all of Merlin's skills first, except for the Invuln. Before swapping Oberon. Because if I swap Oberon, that is a fail. Or if I swap Oberon and then Merlin whips a skill because I did it prematurely, that's a fail. Okay, good. We got a Kentucky Buster. Excellent. Oh, 
Your defense works on a C. That's correct. You can actually use those if you want to. Okay, here we go. There we go. Did she get stunned? Hold on. Oh! Oops, ignore that. You didn't see that. <laughs> That's the secret sauce. You weren't meant to look at that. Okay, so one problem with this plan... If I want to min turn, actually, if I want to just like finish the fight, I could let it play out because I don't actually need buffs. But if I want to min turn, I can't actually have that stun go off. That's very unfortunate. It's a low probability stun, too. You can't rely on it for shit. I've been exposed. Now chat knows I haven't actually been farming NA with my feet this entire time. How could this happen? Okay. Let's see if we can get a little uh, RNG difference here. Oh, look at that variance, dude! Holy shit! We went from like, what, 790k to 900k? Anyway, yeah, okay, so that's a kill. This is probably one of the easiest min turns in recent memory for a challenge quest. Thank fuck that EO's protection is not foolproof. But soon. Mm, excuse me. Soon we're going to start to get, like, a style of uh, challenge quest where you're actually punished for trying to min turn. Because I think, uh, I don't know, I think the first one appears in next summer. Where, like, if you try and, like, uh, rush down Nagnaria, she actually enrages and gets way harder. Anyway, yeah, that's it for, uh, semi strat. Now, give me a moment while I return the third hand to work in order. They can make it so that if you try to make their next enemies appear, that dude, that'd be fucked. Oh, you got her? Congratulations! Who'd you end up running? Or who'd you end up running? Also here, uh, Curse Catalyst. So we did one for Zieri, which was this one. Lower the price, get out of my store. Now let's do Epic 11. Ah, you ran Jalter, huh? Very nice. All right, here you go, Epic. The smaller the battery, the bigger its scrim. Alright, Manga Pyro, your turn. Wait, what is this? <laughs> what the fuck?
Me, absolutely twisted, coming home with a load of swords. Me, waking up the next day with a room full of swords. Okay, so now let's go back to this challenge quest, shall we? You're doxing at me, oh my god. Okay, so for this one, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna try to see if I can Ushi goes in this. So we want to put all of our damage onto Gawain. I believe is the play here. So we run triple Scotty. We run the damage CE. This account does not have poster girl, but I can just do that. And then who is our finisher for when things go to shit? I could run Space Arresh. Unfortunately, a lot of my single targets aren't uh, up to snuff. Yeah, you know what? We'll just keep uh, Dalter. There we go. I mean, hopefully that's good enough. Something like you with the uh, Magic the Gathering after you or Gunpla? Oh my, I can only imagine. Waking up to a room full of Gunpla boxes? And you think, when the fuck am I going to make these? Quite ideal. Oops. Gonna make it for I played a little bit on stream. It's quite fun. Although that uh, there is like if you play the English dub, it's like okay for the most part, but there's one character that just sucks ass. Holy shit. You summer Ibuki? Ah, uh, that would do it. Magic the Gathering? Oh, that reminds me. When they announced that Lord of the Rings thing, like with the, the one of one ring, I was like, oh, you know what? I'll get a I'll get like two collector boxes. Why the hell not? And so they arrived in the mail, but by then someone had already pulled the box in question. So I was like, oh okay, fuck me. So much for that, I guess. What the fuck is this Gawain? God damn, take some damage. Maybe he, like, takes less damage from whoever he puts his trade on.
I'm not quite sure what the mechanic is on this one. Oh, he's anti-crit? So they really want an art servant for this thing. Fuck me. Yeah, probably not getting out of this one. Yeah, I mean, so obviously this is where I bust out Salieri. Curses. I have too many moon cancers on this team. Oh, sorry, I have too many moon cancers on my account, I should say. Space Arrest Shilling Quest? You know what? Fine. I'll pay them their pound of flesh. A cursed delight work. I mean, a cursed lazengel. Oh no! Hold on. I gotta go pull up. Uh, I gotta go pull up the arrest rules. Ah, oh, fuck me. Okay, so we run that Arash and then not Arash. That's Scotty and another Scotty. Okay, that's too expensive. What do I cheap out on? Uh, cheap out on that. Run this. There we go. Okay. Now we met the cost. Okay, let me go look up uh, Space Arrest's rules. Let's go, Brockas. Randy <laughs> rules. Okay, let's fucking go. That's one. Okay. Hmm. Now, so say the others for next turn. Why not Summer Ibuki? Well, that would require me to have Summer Ibuki. I have a Summer Ibuki that's stronger than my Arash. Which I do, just not on this account. There has to be some condition that makes... Because we saw in the last fight that buff fell off. That's what's got me baffled. Okay, that's turn-based. It's just turn-based. So we really just don't have a choice on that one. Okay, so with this we form a valid Brave Chain. I heard you're planning to be judge of Rio Emerald next week. Do you have any feelings on the situation? Yeah, guilty. <laughs> Why 
What the fuck is that extra card? I wonder how the fuck you min turn this fight. Seems like a real pain. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so we're currently at Darling. Level 10 is when we get the really crazy shit. Actually, no, level 7 is when we get the good shit. Level 10 is when we get, like, the guaranteed everything crits every turn. Well, every turn we get P. It involves really strong non crit face cards and extra cards? What the fuck? Okay, we still have our full set of buffs on this one. Yeah, that's just NP. Wow, so critting's actually counterproductive. That's so annoying. Oh, shit. Okay, that's not ideal. She seems to have some form of debuff immunity. That might be a problem. Okay. Dude, we are really close to destiny. We're really close to, uh... Space of Rush Destiny. My favorite Gundam series. There we go! We did it. Peak Arresh has been reached. Yeah, let's do this to keep our castaways alive. Damn. Hey, how's it going, Gamaza? How goes it? Oh, so how's it going, Mobius? Dude, she really had a bone to pick with that Castoria, damn. Uh, yeah, we just... Oh, you know what? There we go. Was that a jump scare? What was that image? Oh shit, does she have anyone pierce? No, we're good. 
Got a little excited. That's an understatement. <laughs> to the stratosphere. <laughs> Alright. There we go! And that's a win. A very painful win, but a win. Okay, now we can begin the real clusterfuck. Still though, I need to come up with some bonus goals, damn. I didn't think we'd go this far. She didn't do her mechanic where she doubles her- she doubles her attacks? What the fuck? At everyone! Please do not announce oh. the server when you're going to masturbate. This has been a recurring issue, and I'm not sure why some people have such <laughs> underdeveloped social skills that they think a server mostly full of my clones would need to know that. No one is going to be impressed Holy to give you a shit. high five, especially considering where that hand has been. I don't want to add this to the rules, since it would be embarrassing for new users to see we have a problem with this, but it's going to be enforced as a rule from now on. If it occurs, you'll be warned. Then additional occurrences will be dealt with at the discretion of the Sakura Five. Thank you. Oh, well. Into the goal where you go, bits. Thank you for the 15,000 bits, Gamasa! Holy shit! Dude, we haven't even decided the new goal yet. Although, tell you what, we're actually on the bonus wheel right now, so Gamasa. Tell you what, Gamasa, I'll, I'll let you do the, I'll let you have the honor, since you've uh, effectively met half of an unknown goal. What do you want to be the new goal? I haven't actually formulated a bonus wheel yet. I got caught off guard. So if you have any ideas, let me know. In the meantime, I believe it's time. Let us enter hell itself. And by hell, I mean the moon. We're going to the moon. The moon has arrived. Will I piss on the moon? 100%. Super Taxi Man, I will, I will fly to the moon just to piss on beams. I will earn my death. Hey guys, this music sounds kind of familiar. Listen to Hanuk, it's it's do or die. If I don't piss on her, she'll piss on me. And that's no good. Okay, Jufu. Attack! Jufu, where's your battery? Jufu? Oh god, I should have brought a code for that. Alright, whatever. Why are those guts red? That's fine, we got this. Oh. 
同じものをもらう We'll get her easy You see, Beeb, I got friends this time Another alien isolation? Okay, you got it Um, oh my god, oh my god. I don't remember that one, holy shit. Hmm. Looking right at me. Uh oh, uh, friends, help! Now, let's see, let me check something before I forget. I can't make an announcement. Fino Tyson is a bitch ass motherfucker. He oh cursed all over my, my god! Wife. That's right, he took his stinky streamer curse out and cursed all over my waifu. And he said his wallet was this big. And I said that's disgusting. Jesus Christ. So that gets us to five. Five times, so that's one, seven, eight. Wait, are we all the way at the goal already? What the fuck? No, we're almost there. Hold on. Here, let me let me actually show it to you. Like, we're actually almost already there. Holy fuck, you guys. Okay, let me show you. If my math is correct, um, this is where we're at. Is this correct? I'd have to check the VOD, but I'm pretty sure that's correct. Holy fuck, you guys. We are in fucking trouble. Here, just throw everything. Throw everything at the beef. Take her out. God damn. <laughs> Level your skills. I think Kalalog might be dead. Oh. It's fine, we got this. Is that maybe an ultra instinct? Yeah, this is this is what happens when you grill BB. Attention! I am Doberman, former military instructor for the Bolivarian Armed Forces. Now let's cut to the chase. Hand oh over god. the list of operators in need of training. Oh my god. They give her the 5,000 bits to Hanuk. And with that, BB is at 116. Holy shit. Yes, thank, you for, thank you for the 5,000 bits to Hanuk and thank you Gamaza for the 20,000. Holy shit. Okay, now question is, uh, you know what, Dahanic? Tell you what, if you want to put anything on the go wheel, I'll give you first dibs. Also, this beeb is absolutely wrecking me. I think it's fitting for beeb to be kicking my ass while this is happening. 
Are servant guys on the table? Yeah. I'm okay with that. Peeves? Which one? The new one? Uh. <laughs> so, I could I could redo one of the- Okay, did you want- Alright, you got it. Oh, God. Also, Principal's fucking dead. How could this happen? Okay, BB. New BB. Ha BB. Nah, no, goddammit. Yeah, BB Dubai Servant Guide. There we go. Oh, we go back to this map. What the fuck? <laughs> Hold on. Welcome to City 17. Zoom out. No! Holy shit, what is that place? Dude, that place got fucked up. Oh, wait a second. We can see what it is on uh, the event map, can't we? What is it? The desert on the bottom left? Doom 1, oh my god. Oh no, we can't see it. Huh. Oh, okay, interesting. Alright, hold on. This is horrifying. God damn. Dude, we are in trouble. Okay, here we go. BB Dubai Servant Guide. Master, say hi no Suzuka, what's the shock? CCC translation patch? Oh no, you're not getting it that easy. You're not getting. I'm not gonna make BB a shoe in like that. I'm gonna put up a fight. The final goal is gonna be my pick. No, I need a. I need a. I need a floodgate. Also, what the fuck? What do they want from me? Oh, you want me to use Bart? Fine. No, fuck you. Give me your own Bart. He's level 80. I mean, that's something. Yay. Alright. Oh my god, are they actually gonna make me do that? Oh! <laughs> Wait, no, I could cheat. I could cheat. We could cheese this. We could cheese this. We could do it the old fashioned way. I got this. Check this out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a fight where I can actually do this. He's the only servant BB Dubai let live because he's the weakest. Oh my god. That's how horrifying. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh, let's Arcuate here. We'll Arcuate on the first and third waves, I think. No, first and second waves.
You want a Black Grail Kentucky? Oh, you mean on my main account? Hold on. Let's give me a moment. There we go. Okay, we don't quite have charge on this. I also want to use Mold Camelot. I don't think Bard has a battery. He has a battery! Holy shit, I forgot he has a battery! Jesus Christ. Oh, I could have used Dark Wade as well, don't think of it. Oh, they're resilient fellows, aren't they? I can't believe we have a fourth Bart support. How horrible. BB really is on a quest to stop me from having fun. How dare you? Oh, Manga Pyro, did I ever do your Curse Catalyst? I think I did, right? My Twitch thing is kind of busted. Too many swords? Yeah, I think that was yours. Okay. Here, you know what? I have a bonus. Oh, Gek, you want one? Alright, here you go. He's getting fucked every day, first sexually and then idiomatically. I believe this was a Shiro Dojin. Ah, Moldy, you want one. Very well. Remember to have just one waifu. Getting more waifu will destroy your laifu. Yafino, don't cheat on Beebs? No. Cheat on Beebs early and often. She's taking a nap. Wait, is it because it's nighttime? No, it's always nighttime. <laughs> we're in space. Well, actually, we're not in space. I forget if the moon is tidally locked. It isn't, right? Or is it? Guys, I don't know the moon very well. Okay, it is tidally locked. Okay, chat, every time they give me this fucking arrangement, I'm gonna pick a different servant. Just to keep things mixed up. How about that? Let's throw Tama Tama at this one. Oh, thank you for the 34 months, Mr. Teaspoon. If you're ever confused, just ask the nearby moon rabbits. Oh, fair, fair. The normal moon is locked. With one side always facing the earth. Ah, uh, okay. 
Oh god. Alright, I'm kinda glad I did this. Jesus Christ. What's Roland doing here? This fucking guy. He's so cool. Oh, he's trading in all his defensive stacks. Uh oh. Run the moon, how does his MP work? Hmm. Also, thank you for the 50 bits, guy. He's just rolling around at the speed of sound. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait a second, what if this isn't actually the moon? What if this is a sound stage? And Tomo's on the real moon. He couldn't answer that question, he just shot himself in a ram. Classic Roland. Also, you know what's really funny? I was doing, um, I've actually been working on a Roland Servant Guide. And I did a little bit of reading. Not his entire, like, uh, catalog, because there's a lot of shit about Roland. But I read um, the story of his death. And allegedly, he is being ganked by an overwhelming number of enemies. And his allies are like, Roland, blow your horn. We got to call for help. And he's like, nah, I'd win. He doesn't win. All right, what is this? Oh, I guess we're fighting Astolfo, huh? Moon Cancer Astolfo? Okay, interesting. Hold on. He is my ruler. You know what? Let's Kagetora this. Don't bring a ruler that's OG Jean. You can't tell me what to do! Let's go! I'll show you! <laughs> Fucking spoiler, spoiler McGee wants to micromanage me. I spit at your help! <laughs> You see that? Kagetora's in timeout now. Look what you've done. <laughs> hey guys, I think um, this might be one of my favorite. It's okay. I have one technique that Astolfo cannot defeat. Uh, changing the volume, that's not what I meant to do. It's okay, we got this. No, 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 it's okay. I know someone that could defeat Astolfo. Easy peasy.
Well, listen. If we can't use rulers, then let's use the next best thing. Queen <laughs> show it? Please don't. Uh, we could start squirting. I'm oh, sorry, that's not the squirt. That's other squirt. That's the new squirt. I want a Zerk. I want a Zerk so bad. Hmm. Oh, all right. Yeah, we'll just run, uh, we'll run Artoria. Let's go. So, no, gee, I thought about it. I thought about it. Okay. Let's fucking go. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Fuck it. Run everything. Use everything. Except those three. I think those three is okay. Alright, let's just go. ストップ。ストップ。スライド。Okay. That should be good. Yeah, it's fine. I want to sit on that evade. I think it's worth just having that little bit of uh, defense that Estoffel gets. So Estoffel gains buffs based on however many skills I have active. Or however many skills that are not on cooldown when his turn starts. That defense buff is only 10%, as far as I could tell, so we could get away with it. I believe this level is chaotic, so I should be able to make up for that atrociously low um, NP level. Before she matches MP, I believe it's the first time I've seen her post post Lost Belt 6 Mold Camelot. I think that's what happened here. Ooh, it's a little bit of a problem. I don't think this involves pierces. Well, if it does, I wouldn't know it. Yeah, let's do it just so we can get the Mighty Chain. Or another Mighty Chain, the Mighty Chain. Monogatari of 
Was 7 the attack? Oh, okay. Or what was it? I, I think her design changed after Trom, didn't it? Or it changed at the very end of Trom. Because the Ordinax got fucked up during Lost Belt 6. And then gets repaired at the very end of Trom. And that's her new appearance. But seven is where it actually goes back to Lord Gamelon. Okay, interesting. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's Bunker Ball. It's not an attack buff. Or it's not a ton. Shit. This is Okay, we, now we got this. Alright. Curse Catalyst. Uh, fabulous. You want a Curse Catalyst? Sure thing. Let's take a look. Oh my. Alright, gentlemen. I have good news and bad news. The good news is I have insider information that they're porting over Space Ereshkigal's affection mechanic to MASH. The bad news is this. You don't have to worry about her getting to 10 every fight? Oh my god. It's true. She only goes up. She's like, uh... <laughs> she's like inflation. You got Keisuke? Oh. Well. Unfortunate. Ortonex is better than the original now. The NP is a flat upgrade. If you need the, if you don't need the original skill one, it's overall better. The original skill one is the defense buff. Mm. For 100% defense strategies, I could st I could still see that being what the fuck. I could still see that being used. But for having to actually fight shit, uh, yeah, I could see the benefits. Especially for these, like, mixed encounters that the story likes throwing so much. Oh god, what am I fighting this time? Oh god, alright, we need a Lancer. Who can save us? <gasps> there you are! Okay, hold on, Oberon. Oberon. I know you're trying to help, but I must confess it's really fucking annoying having you try and micromanage how I do every fight before I even get a chance to look at it. You know what I mean? So how about you do me a favor and dial it back? Ritomonte has arrived. Check this out. We got an easy victory. Don't look. Don't look at that. <laughs> we got an easy, easy victory, lads. Don't worry about it. Am I lying? Yes. Don't tell Kyohime. Check this out. 
One of these is her battery, right? Oh. <laughs> Oops. It's fine. Oh, Brennamark, please! Shoot her! Damn it! Alright, fine. I was hoping to sit on that. Fuck me! Oh, that's filth. That's fucking filthy. Oh, she doesn't have Invuln Pierce. I mean, well, surely Bredemart. Uh, Bre oh, it's not a Bredemonte. Surely Bredemart does, right? You got this. Easy. Thank fuck for Brado Marte. Now we just have to get... I just have to get her NP back up. Okay. Let's do this. We can charge off these, hopefully. Failing that, what I'll do is I'll uh, break their bars and then have her NP once they're down. God damn. Alright, hold on. Oh, uh, yes, it did, Teal Smith. Yes, it did. Oh, Mash can pierce through those. I guess that's how you're intended to go through them, huh? Okay, there we go. Okay, so now we attack the other one. Yeah, it's fine. Hopefully this pops. Either way, we have to be Radomart next turn. Okay, let's go. Whatever. Still gives... Oh, that doesn't give MB damage. Oops, whatever. Alright, behold! Dude, I lucked out. I didn't actually realize Bradomart had, in, like, Invuln Pierce. I just picked her for, a, like, a meme. That was very lucky. I, I was assuming I'd have to restart the fight. So, are you- if you don't have an Invuln Pierce servant, are you intended to just use Mash as Invuln Pierce? That's horrifying.
I shudder to think. I'm doing the opposite of that one gun, the image. I'm an idiot! Oh yeah! Oh, you can stall the fight until you win. Oh, I see. It has a time limit. I suppose that works, too. Man, they are really chewing me up in terms of uh, resources, huh? Wait. <laughs> Hold on. I know who that is. I think it's only fair that we say hi. I kind of wish it would keep my previous party settings. Just on my apples? Listen, it, it's... I have accumulated those apples through a long and concerted period of slacking. Behold! Beam Squad! Do this. Unfortunately, it's my support that needs to be beaming here. <laughs> Triple Kawaii meta? Use BB's alternate skill. Oh wait, I can't! This BB can only use a regular skill, huh? Well, that's a little annoying. Alright, hold on. Looks like Team Bonzi buddy's blasting off again! Alright, I got this. I mean, so I recall hearing that a lot of this chapter is actually dialogue, so maybe we can actually plow through it in short order. Now that I'm curious about something, chat. Do you like these sort of restricted, uh, restricted like party fights where they kind of scale down the enemies to accommodate for it, or do you like the ones where you're supposed to go absolutely apeshit with your main roster? You guys prefer ape shit? 
Understood. Wait, do I have that in my catalyst folder? Hold on. Damn, I don't. Oh, I can't find it. Somewhere out there, there's an image of, uh... It's either of Rin or Ishtar going, Don't you want to go ape shit? Okay, what is this? Oh, come on! That's my front line? Well, what if I... All right, hold on. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. I have a plan. Where is... Actually, no. Who the fuck needs a plan? We got Castoria. I should do for ease of access. I should just do this. There we go. Perfect. Let's form a little bond. Actually, I think this gives more. There we go. Now, if only I could have, like, they need, I don't know if they, like, added something. I just, I'm just missing it. But they seriously need to add, like, a default, like, a default party just for these types of missions. Especially when they kind of just shit them out repeatedly. Alright, let's go. Are you fucking with me? Guys, it's Proto Cyber Dragon. Okay, well, I mean, we gotta hit the fucking thing, I guess. So normally in Divinity, the worst. I've I fought Cyber Dragon in Divinity like once in my life, and it was the worst fucking thing ever. There are 50 battles here total. That's pretty short for like a three part chapter. Yeah. Although it means in two years, I'm gonna have a very bad time. Oh my god, Metro and he crashed. 
Because I have to read exactly. Reading is agony. Dude, every time, like, it's like whenever I encounter a new archetype in Yu-Gi-Oh, like, my, I die inside and my, my eyes glaze over and my fucking, my skin dries up. You should have seen the look on my face the first time I ever, I ever had to fight a pearly deck. And I, I was, I was, I had to read this fucking avalanche of text on like 20 new cards that were all coming out on turn one. Also, thank you for the 67 months of the tier 2, Alice. I never realized how much gas exhaust Space BB releases. I'm. Whoa! Oh no, I don't like this anymore. <laughs> oh yeah, how's it going, Alice? Excuse me, it appears that my beeb is dying. Well, that can't be good. No, it's okay, though. It's my chance to be rid of her. You got this. Oh, no, wait, she has guts! I can't get rid of shit! Oh, not anymore. There we go. Yeah! Fuck you, Beebs! Wait, Beebs, come back! This is worse! BB, come back. No, it's fine. Listen. 22 chapters, chat. We could do it. Listen. Yu-Gi-Oh has, fi has finally honed my reading skills, and with that, I can trivially blow through 22 chapters worth of text. Behold, my secret technique to understanding the game. Immaculate. Easier than fighting Elizabeth for six hours? True. Oh, sorry, you didn't specify six. Well, it's okay, I'll tell you, it was six hours. Six and a half, I think. It was pretty bad. How did I learn of this power? Ah, it's from playing Hearthstone, a game where I don't need to read. Six hours and 17 minutes fighting Elizabeth. Jesus Christ, what's wrong with me? Ooh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, fuck! I meant to pick quick. I beat one of the hardest bosses in SMT. I'll take it. 
I'll take it. That fucking sucked, though. Holy shit. No! Needle with the kill! No! Bart with the kill, too! Damn it all. No, wait, I could do this. Yo, is that Starbucks? Oh shit! Hey, what's up, Otto? You caught me in the middle of eating something. Welcome! Hold on. I just drink it, sir. Welcome! And, oh, thank you, Sonic Brandon, for the 49 months of my dude. I appreciate it very much. Not much this week? Ah, I see. Yeah, I'm trying to catch up on OC3 myself. I actually just ground out the event this morning. I see Kira's buff. I saw that she did get a buff. What'd she get? Like anti alignment? Here, let's take a look. Kiara Seshoin. Anti good alignment. Yeah, anti good alignment. 20% party charge. One stage overcharge? That's a good combo. Honestly, though, you know what Kara needs the most? She probably needs a second NP buff. If I'm gonna be real with you. What trickery is this? I get to pick my own CE? What's the catch? Not my own CE, my own servants. Oh wait, no, there's always a catch. No, 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 I'm on I'm onto this fucking game. Hold on. Ooh. Do I fucking do it? Yeah, let's fucking do it. No, let's not fucking do it. Never mind. Never mind. You didn't see that. Ignore that. Pay that no mind. <laughs> yeah, I thought about running Shiba, then I saw then I saw my Shiba's uh everything. It's fine, we go with a plan B on this one. Let's see, what is my plan B? Does Alice have Invulm Pierce? I can't read! <laughs> I can't read! Fuck! Alright, it's fine. I know someone who will give in Von Pierce. Without fail. Where the fuck is she? There you are! There's Calamity Jane. Okay, so we run Calamity Jane. Who is our main DPS? Remember when you entered the room of your first SSR waifu Shiba, and came right as you touched the floor? It was me, Fino. I was the floor. I licked your feet at snake waist speed, so it seemed like you nutted from going into a girl's room! Oh! <laughs> Damn it! Alright, thank you for the 5,000 bits, Moldy. Shiba it is. 
<laughs> oh, fuck. Okay, okay. I got this, I got this. So we run two Castorias, let's run Oberon. Oh, this is gonna... I'm gonna get my ass beat. Oh, fuck. That's the thing, Otto. They won't do it because... Listen. They... You would not leave your Shiba in such an emaciated state. I would. It, this is my just desserts. They're... They're... They're inflicting justice upon me for my crimes against Foxkind. Or perhaps Jackalkind. I don't know if it's ever established what kind of animal Shiva's supposed to be. Okay. Now I just need to remember which of Shiba's skills is the Invalm Pierce and not use that right away. Okay, so Shiba's is skill two, so don't use skill two. Okay. Yeah. I'll oh, have Jin. Oh, that checks out. Dude, I'm being reminded of just how lopsided this account is. Like, holy shit, it is all over the place. Okay, there's the invul. Okay. So now we get Oberon. And we use this. And this. And we sit on the third skill. So I think we're good on that. Alright. Alright, looking pretty good. Also, you know what? I figured out what I want to put on the wheel. Oh, it still has its invuln. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Ooh, I... I didn't think this went through. Okay, three hits, three hits. We just need to buy, uh, play for a little bit of time. <laughs> like, on one hand, I could have attacked all three times last turn, but then I also feel like in the previous encounter, that actually fucked us pretty badly. If only they buffed her to give her a three-turn Invuln Pierce. Honestly, they could make the Invuln Pierce a default part of her Noble Phantasm, and she would still only see Nishu's. At least we don't have Zendaya rolling them. <laughs> Soon, can you fucking imagine? <laughs> Netflix's Fate Grand Order. 
starring Zendaya as Mash Kyrielite. That's good to fuck me. Okay, sorry about that. I was chewing on something. How's it going, Pyro? Ryan Reynolds as Blackbeard? Dude, that'd be too good. That would actually be a good casting choice. They would never allow such a thing. Wait, <laughs> hold on, hold on a second. I don't know why, I just assumed that was, I was looking at a moon cancer icon. Wait, 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 <laughs> you, you know what, you make a good point. Hold on, hold on a fucking second. There we go. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I wonder, you know what, I should go and, like, go through the VOD and see how much of this OC3 is me just setting up the party. Getting out to the end? Alright, have a good one, dude. Thanks for stopping by. You can press auto party? Really? Damn. Auto team builder? No, I haven't. Oh, that's the pop up. So I should click on the left thing, maybe? Fly might be fly. Now you know what? Go over the loot. Oh, so it'll take care of the minimum requirements. Oh. I gotta say, BB turning into Rocket Warrior is not what I expected to see in 2024. That screen, press the right most. Okay, well, thank you. Yeah, thank you for the tip, Rio. I can use this.
question chat. Um, so there are new items from this ordeal call, right? Why are they toenails? That's kind of fucked up. Bibi can keep those to herself. They only use for a pens and for the new welfare. Or the new freebie. Okay. King Proteus? Ugh. Chat, I'm going to go out on a limb and uh, put forth with the hypothesis that King Protea is probably the least hygienic of the Sakura 5. And so that's absolutely fucking terrifying. What the fuck? This is a level 100 Constantine. Wait, this is, um, imaginary scramble music, isn't it? Oh. Oh no, it actually kept my party for once! Shit! I was too eager to push the button. Fuck's sake. Oh, that's fine. I'll hit the red cancel. Oh! Excellent. Wait, did it default to Europa? That's horrifying. Jesus Christ. Oh, yo, let's do this. Hold on. Alright, behold, chat. Dude, my FGO NA is, like, freaking out. I've been trying to start it up for like the last uh, little while. Behold, the dirtiest party. Yes, Tama, yes, yes. Come to the carriage. Do you have a kid and a kid? I know, you 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 all right, hold on. I need to restart Map Geo NA. It's actually been like fucking up for the past half hour. Dude, Bart's got that bronze hate going on. Okay, next fight. What what are we doing? I feel like we've been kind of like doing a circuitous route to sneak up on Beebs. You see that? It's the stuff of nightmares. Yo, is that a launch pad? Hold on. Oops, hold on. I didn't mean to do that. 
Look at that. Shiro could high jump the shit out of that. <laughs> That's his charm point. Oh. Oh, okay. The fuck? Hold on, let's do this. Okay, so we got... Yeah, this combo should do it. Forced mash ain't that the truth. You cannot escape mash Kyriolite. She's a universal constant. Oh my god, my FGO's still not working! Okay, hold on. I may need to actually, after this fight, I may need to restart all of my FGOs. Just to make NA start working again. Uh, what's the one that makes her invulnerable? Oh, there we go. No, my NA thing is shot. I'll have to uh, restart all of them. Man, I wish Lip were better. She's definitely... Like, she was sort of a jank unit, even from, like, her initial release. Isn't her stick being a tank? Well, it, here's, here's my question then. Why didn't, don't, like, why doesn't she have better tanking skills or a better tanking class? The, well, the answer to the latter is that they want Alter Egos to be like this sort of mixed, like half Berserker style offensive class, which sort of put, rules out option number two. So if they wanted her to be a tank, they probably should have just given her better, uh, like, better tanking skills. Anyway, give me a second, chat. I gotta restart my FGOs. To try and salvage NA. Now, to give me just a moment. Here, you know what? Let me pull out something to, uh, keep you occupied. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, oh, Rafael, you want to curse Catalyst? Here, let me get you another one. Hmm. Set training in order to increase our bond level. See? Hold on. I want to point out, Gudao here looks like, he's got like his, uh, he, he looks a little a bit like Kiritsugu with those eyes. G 
GeoJP. There we go. Okay, now I just need to hope main starts working again. Go, go, go! Moon Cancer? Oh, shit. Now we got this. I'd win. Easy victory. Oh. Oh. Uh, that's a problem. Okay, we're getting there. We got this. Easy peasy. I know, nah, whatever's wrong with my NA, it is like sticking. Oh, shit. It's fine. Mash will tank it. Yeah, no, she's got this. No, we got this. Oh, I remember this. I remember this fucking mechanic. Wait. No, easy peasy. Hey, chat. I get the impression this isn't a fight I meant to win. I can't sleep, probably, yeah. Dude, this is the FGO equivalent of, like, um, that time in Pokemon where you walk into a random house and Cynthia's just there. You go into a shopping mall, do a little bit of espionage, and all of a sudden you run into Koi and Skya, and you just instantly start throwing hands. That's what I'm going to assume happened. Ah. 
the fuck is wrong with my FGO? Holy shit. Must be from using the third hand too much. Is there an update on NA? Good question. Hold on. Let's check. Search Fate Grand Order. Play. Nah, no update by the look of it. Oh, the the, uh, the weekly rollover happened. That was when it started to go wrong. What is this music? Okay, I guess we're going back to Christmas. Naturally. Uh, let's see. Oh my god. Wait, I have an idea. Hold on. I read something very interesting just now. No, we got this. I'd win. Actually, this will let me test something else, too. Okay, apparently, Anderson for this specific fight has a Miss Crane-esque mechanic where he will do a thing and then eject himself out of the front line. However, if there are fewer than, uh, if there are three or fewer servants in your party when this happens, he just kills himself. How horrifying. Go. Yeah, you know what? Okay. We removed two stacks of reduction. Good. We're getting there. Okay. 
All right, we done it. I want to sit on BB's abilities for a little bit. For uh, reasons. Okay, now we go like this. So fun. Hey guys, guess who forgot how BB works? <laughs> okay, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Now that now that I've shown you how Anderson do. That's why we need the guide? What do you mean? I don't need no stinking guide. Here's what we do need though. What we need is a powerful, brutal, single-target assassin. Does Sojo work? That's a good question. We could try it. Although mine is, uh... Well, actually, mine's pretty good. Yeah, we could do go for it. What is this NP type again? Buster. Oh, oh. Fine. Tell you what. I'll make it so BB will come in. Once Anderson fucks off. Man. Actually, can I make Lip fuck off? Damn it. Alright, it's fine. We got this. Let's go. Oh, you meant that guide. Well, it's too late. I've already brought in a beeb. Yo, chat, I like how as fucked up as this account is, it has two copies of Ox Demon King Max Limit Broken. People would fucking kill for that. Then again, I would also kill to get Poster Girl on this account. But that ship's already sailed. Dude, they could unironically just bring back the Guda Guda one banner and it would shit it would shit. It would sell like hotcakes only because of poster girl. Alright. I forgot how Sojuro's skills work, so I'm just gonna push all the buttons. Oh, he doubles! <laughs> he doubles his effects! It's a multi- fuck me! Alright, whatever. Whatever, it's fine. 
It's fine, it's fine, we got this. I can make this work still. It's okay. We're gonna be okay. Only I could read. What? <laughs> what was that? What did he mean by this? I don't know what the fuck this means. Oh, let me just look him up. I was hoping to not have to do that. Shizuki Sojiro. Okay, uh, Grants changes all- Oh, after one turn it changes all of his cards to a specific- Well, that's not gonna matter. Too late. We go in. Full beans. Jesus Christ! Pretty fucking good, isn't he? Damn. Beeb's back. Alright, in case he fucks around, we can do that. Like single target a rush? Yeah. Okay, now we just need to get through his uh, damage reduction. Go, Lip, go! Come on, one crit! Crit one time! Fuck. Oh, maybe I should have gone with the Buster Chain here. That probably would have done more. Never mind. I lucked out. Evidently, if I just keep rolling the dice, it'll eventually roll in my favor. Actually. Huh. That gave me an idea. Chat? I'm gonna do a bad thing. Just keep rolling the dice, huh? Yeah, I could do that. Let's go! Boom! Skip roll. Check this out. Gold Servant, easy. Gold. Gold servant. Easy. Gold.
Gold Servant? Come on, come on. Damn it! Gold Servant easy. Gold Servant easy. Gold Servant easy. No! Wah. My greed! Oh, my beautiful reward! Oh god. Yes, just give it all to me. Why is this my team? What did they mean by this? Oh! This is fighting a moon cancer. Okay. Well, in that case. Mm-mm. Ruler Moriarty. My favorite. Wait a second, though. Yo! This auto feels cultured. It, it defaulted to Golden Sumo. You know what? Maybe it's not so bad after all. How should I do this? I think I should have Kagetora just go first, because I trust her damage more. I just need to remember which is her battery to not use it. Kagetora. I guess she's Kenshin, technically. Okay, so we have uh, two, two turn evade, or two hit evade. Okay, second skill is the battery. Let's go. Master Kagetora, the best ruler DPS? She sure seems like it. God, look at that shit. I didn't even use my real buffs. Oh. I didn't realize she would MP right away. Wait! She turned into light? No! <laughs> wait, wait. Time, time out, time out. I had to man to redo. <laughs> Kagatora, yeah, Kagatora's arts. Okay, new plan. That's nasty, though. She turns into Koyan Light. 
Because that's a Koyan. That's Koyan Darks versus Engine right there. Alright, let's do this. この Okay, I have a plan. Cancel. Okay, this should shield us from Quinn's reprisal. NFGO NA still loading. That is a real problem. Anyway, let's do this now. Actually, you know what? Now's probably a good time to use Dobrynia's. Because Dobrynia has class advantage right now because of her special effect. Oh, Dobrynia, no! Where's your damage at? Jesus Christ. So many buffs, I thought I could get away with it. I have the pseudo class advantage. Oh, wait. I heard the ass causes problems. Hold on. There we go. Okay, now she's become Koi and Dark. Okay, we got this. You know what? Let's just go in. Big dick. All right, we got her. Wow, that's a dirty fight. Okay, chat, where does part one end for this? Surely part one's not 20 something chapters. Chapter 11? Okay. Oh god, we're only on 7. Fuck me. Dude, this early section... They really make it churn through fights in this, don't they? Nine and then 14. Okay. Dabrini is a lovely little potato.
You know, I could use Melusine. But if I'm gonna do that, I may as well do it right. Okay, let's run to uh, Double Lancer. Double Lancer, and we start with... Hmm, who's my alternative? I could just do Canis. Yeah, let's go Canis. Zero IP story will get you through the back half, thank fuck. A sexy potato. Okay, so I'm guessing the bulk of what we're trying to do is get to chapter 14. Because then we got a free shot towards the end. And I can get towards the real raid boss. What the fuck? Kakugo <laughs> Lenny's figure collection wants to battle. You're gonna pull a jet screw attack on that there, sir. Most dreadful. Alright, thankfully we still got the God of Grail front. Yo, let's fucking go! Party Big Melu's back in town. There we go, fucking surgical. Tamitomo is so cool, you're still nipped him and everyone from that event got completely overshadowed. Yeah, dude, he's... Aesthetics-wise, he's like up there. It's funny too, because he... Like, they make him seem so cool in Trom. Maybe they weren't confident in him as a big seller. Oh, okay. I see who we're fighting in the next one. All right. You motherfucker. It's on. I know who's, I know who's fighting this. 100%. I know who's fighting this. Ah, oh, shit. No, not this. None of this. No, no, no. We're settling this the old-fashioned way. Let's fucking go. Are there even any space capable rulers? 
No, there aren't. Okay, so if I did this, it would have to be a... Well, you know what? Let's run uh, Speresh as our uh, backline. Easy way to sell more time at Tumbles, make him a girl and make him take off his armor. They tried that though! They tried that! That's what Britomart is! You know, I forgot about that turn one thing. Fine. It's fine. Don't kill my bitch! Don't ditch the bitch. Alright, let's go. People didn't like Rotomark because she looked like she's from a mobile game ad and gonna tell you where, where are your attack, my lord? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's it? I'm going to be real with you. I was expecting a, like a much worse fight. I thought she was going to be on my ass. Okay, hold on. Oh, there we go. Salt. Oh, hold on. Let me, let me get yours first. Let's take a look. What? <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, just download the fucking file. There we go. We are fucking under attack! Wait. Hold on. I could, I could do this, I could do this. Oh my god. Why are you in my room? Shit. Oh, I guess I only select sorted. Fuck. Alright, hold on. Alright, there we go. There's Britomart. Perfect. There's the other Britomart. Perfect. Oh, 
Oh, did I fuck this up? Why is Purin still here? Am I losing my fucking mind? You know they pushed it. Where the fuck do I set it then? I I would my kingdom for some so I could read. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's this. It's the heart. Hey guys, apparently the heart's the favorite, not the star or the other star. Silly me. Seamless. For absolutely fucking seamless. Although you know what, chat? Are you no salt? Salt. Hold on. You know what has similar energy, but a completely different aesthetic? Senpai? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, CL's here. Alright. Chia Sensei, offer me your wisdom. What are we doing? Oh, God. Okay. On odd numbered turns. So we actually, I actually want to swap my main, my main DPS or my main enabler in. Okay. In that case, let's keep Kagatora in um, as my like follow-up DPS. Actually, who are some interesting spaceflight capable servants? Uh, Beebs? We can run Beebs. Not the one I want for this team, though. We got Beebs, we got Kuko Khan. Melos Melosine? Yeah. Go to space, Melosine. Oh, but it's not ruler Melosine. This is bullshit. My bees need to be inflated more. No, someone! She's already going to 116! I'll die! I'll die if this BB gets any stronger. Oh wait, let's do this. There we go. No, wait. It's wrong. There we go. OG Melisine counts? I'm guessing it's because of the whole dragon thing. She never actually does turn into Albion in um, her summer form. Just a fucking fighter jet. Look, listen, I've seen Macross. I, I fucking know fighter jets work in space. Level 8, isn't it? You son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Congrats on reaching 118 BB. I'm not at 118 BB, though. No, wait! No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. At everyone. 
Please do not wait, announce wait, wait, the wait. server when you're going to oh, masturbate. God. This has been a recurring issue, and I'm not sure why some people have such underdeveloped social skills that they think a server mostly full of my clones would need to know that. No one's going to be nice to give you a high five, especially considering where the hand has been. I don't want to add this to the rules, God since it would be damn. embarrassing for new users to see we have a problem with this. It's going to be enforced as a rule from now on. If it occurs, you'll be warned. Then additional occurrences will be dealt with at the discretion of the Sakura 5. Thank you. Oh, God. So thank you for the... <laughs> thank you very much for... Oh, my God. The 20,000 bits, the Hanuk. Jesus Christ. And with that, we are now targeting level 118 for Beebs and... TL Smith is good to five tier one, tier one subs. Thank you very, very much, TL Smith. Oh, you guys. You guys are so great. But why must the Beeb torment me? We'll never get it, but a certain first OVA needs the Macross to you remember love ending sequence with... Echon singing like mid mage, dude. I I would kill for that. All right, coin is down. No, don't stun my Scotty! Don't stun my Scotty, Talalak! Asshole! Oh, look at this hand! You know, that got me thinking, Saul. How much do you do you think it would cost to do a hostile takeover of Harmony Gold? I mean, surely if they had any intention of selling the fucking company, they would have done it by now. 20k? Dude, I, for 20k, I would do it. Then I could take Macross hostage. You're an oil prince, hence your affinity for cousin of BB. Oh, you. Okay, we're finally on chapter eight. Listen, it's like bankruptcy. We gotta work away to chapter 11. The rights to Macross are a nightmare. My understanding is that not only are the rights domestically in Japan, like all over the fucking place, but the rights in America are like turbo fucked because uh, some fucking company called Harmony Gold has a per what is, to my understanding, a perpetual license in the states to Macross. Because when they were licensing anime out in the uh, the eighties and stuff, they didn't quite know the copyright game yet. Oh no, Rio, what is this? Let's take a look. Perfect, it's beautiful, Rio. We are fucking under attack. <laughs> you know what? Here. Perfect. It's beautiful now. You know what? Right next to the the BB level, I think that's like. I think it's. I think it fits. It fits perfectly. Oh my God. What am I fighting now? Some assassin? Oh god, it's this fucking thing again. Fine. I 
I can't get a perpetual license for your art software, but they can get a perpetual license for a whole fucking franchise. Yeah, it's, it's insane. Who's the character? You've seen her before, but it's not clicking. Oh, which one? You mean the one in uh, We Are Fucking Under Attack? Uh, that's Bradamante. Or she's sometimes called Britomart. He's the butt of the joke. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Hey guys, maybe I shouldn't have used Castoria with the Buster Servant. Ah, well, benefit of hindsight. Yeah, man, NA's just fucked. Yo, Gag, if you're listening and you're still waiting for my Kentoki, uh, you're gonna need to find another one. My NA account just is not loading. At all. It's uh, stuck in perpetual loading. After it says, do you want to clear cash? Regardless of whether I say yes or no, it's just stuck in loading. They finally got me? Yeah, it's because I showed my uh, third hand. They knew my secrets. Oh yeah, I need to start thinking up some goals. Hold on. I'm sure I can cook something up. Okay. Now this is where BB shines. Behold. The might of Bonzi Buddy. You know, I feel like Mimi did about as much damage as Castoria there. I don't know how to feel about that. So you mean that form? Oh, uh, you mean Biebs? Yeah. And they're off. Okay, well, I was able to log in a mistake for whatever reason. NA, though, is not playing along. The fuck is this? Why do they want me to use so many archers? We're fighting a mix, aren't we? Yeah, it's one of each. Okay.
In that case, let's go with... Just a servant that has Invuln Pierce. Generic Invuln Pierce. Doesn't, doesn't uh, Ruler Melusine have Invuln Pierce? Who's got the sub goal? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, only OG has? Shit. Alright, hold on. Let me see who I want to use for this. Ah, uh, if I had Musashi, she'd be good for this. Wait! I've got it. Check this out. Wait, filter list is first section... First option, second row from the bottom? Oh, like this. Oh! Is this accurate? Oh, the checkboxes. Oh, okay. Second row from the bottom. So it's... Eh. This one. Yeah, okay, that looks like... Oh, that's why it defaulted to Durga. Okay, well, it's good to know. But it's okay, I got this. I'll show them the mic. Chat, you want your fucking Huyan Zhou? I'll show you Huyan Zhou. Here, I'm, I'm too lazy to actually bother swapping all the Scotty Z's. Shit takes too long. I'm in it for speed now, baby. Try clearing FGO's cash the hard way for NA. Oops, there we go. Okay, that worked. Interesting. This out. Behold, the power of this servant that was foisted upon me. No one forced me, they absolutely did. By the way, I've been listening to a, uh, what is effectively an audiobook. Uh, a, a very uh, a very paraphrased audiobook of the water margin. It's fucking nuts, dude. I haven't even gotten to Huyan Zhou's part yet. It's it's absolutely fucking crazy. Like there's a dude and he goes to an inn and the lady there tries to drug him and cut him up and put him in the meat buns, but like uh, it's okay. Uh, it, the, the conversation ends with him going, No, these are good, fine people. Whatever, let's, let's keep going. It's like a guy that fucking gets wasted. And his legend begins with him going through a mountain pass. After he's wasted, getting ambushed by a tiger and fucking uh, fist fighting the tiger. Uh, Suikoden, yes, that's correct. Suikoden is based on the water margin. Uh, 
Yeah, Ryo, you said Suikoden is just the Japanese for water margin, right? I just think they remember this. Okay, there we go. I'm, I'm back on NA. I can get back on my grind. Actually, hold on. Let me actually set my support list real quick before I forget. Okay, for any of my friends list that still wants it, my Kentoki is... Oh, shit. Where's my grail? There we go. Okay, my Kentoki's in my all slot. Event all slot with um, black grail. There you go. I finally got around to setting it. Also, what the fuck is all this? No, you know what? I know what we're doing. Come on. Let me use my own team. Yes! Let me use my own team. Uh, surely, surely I could just put this mash in the back, right? Oh, they let me! They fucking let me. Holy fuck. There is a god. Yo, let's go! The gloves are off! Crew expendable. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Let's give him the old one two Melu Massacre. Hey, what's up, Zerk? I have no invo pierce? Ah, who cares? Oh. I got Melusy. What are they gonna do? Okay, that's a little annoying. It's fine. I have a way out. You're playing the street dungeon when you should be learning how to play Asian mythology? Oh boy. Dude, I, I, I need to sit down and give it a look myself. Because I hear they changed quite a bit from the OG game. Ah, oh, do I NP here? That's the real question. I think I should. I don't think I'm going to meet the damage check otherwise. Oh my god! No, hold on. I'm mulliganing that. Did you fucking see that damage? Okay, I was actually expecting to have to NP. I was just trying to generate some stars for next turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that I think that'll do it. I 
Out of curiosity, did any of you guys end up hard farming the uh, Yamatai Koku event? I kind of slacked off, so I didn't really get around to it until yesterday. Well, the hard farming part. I was keeping up with the... Uh, I was on pace with the main story, at least. I mean, for Tamlin Cup, I see. Honestly, I was thinking, I'm thinking like, God, maybe I should have just so I could stock up on flame lights. Because gold resources are a pain in the ass to get. What's Kama doing here? What's Google Khan doing here? Oh, what the fuck? All right. Casual Talos, huh? Edison Altar? What Edison Altar would fight you with, I think, a giant mech? No, that's not true. Edison Altar would fight you with a terrible running joke. That has haunted this game from its very beginning. Fucking AC. Can I see what Edison Alter looks like? Yeah, let's take a look. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Fucking Gurn Lagan? Guys, look! I recognize that light bulb anywhere! It's gray from Mark Knights! Wow, perfect. Jesus Christ. I like how, um... Wait a second! Instead of saying USA, his little, uh, his little halo says Usagi. So I, I, I suppose he's supposed to be a rabbit of some variety. Interesting. Got the touch and the power. Shit. All right. 
I got excited for a second thinking I could target Mash's invuln. Doesn't work like that. Oh, it actually works out perfectly. It's Castoria. Listen, Summer Melu might not be quite at Ibuki's caliber, but goddamn. I've gotten a lot of mileage out of this one. Fuck me, that was loud. <laughs> okay, did we do it? End of part one? Come on, baby. End of part one. Huh? Huh? At long fucking last. Part one is complete. Oh, fuck me. You know what that means, chat? Gamble. Let's go. Oh, it's a servant. I can feel it. It's a servant. Yo, 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 yo. Come on. Alter ego. Alter ego. Okay. 50 50. It is Passionate the Third. Finally. Wait, there's another one. Oh, never mind. I've gotten more passion lips today than I have in the previous, like... God. <laughs> I, you know what? I was gonna give a number. Don't worry about it. Ever. The rest of my time playing FGO JP combined. You yeah, use the magic it. bong, now glance upon my magnum dong! Oh! Thank you for 100 bits, Mystic! Did you end up using the... Fast kill strat? Oh, hell yeah, dude. Yeah, if you could do it, like, if, as long as you meet the damage check, it... It feels a lot easier and more consistent to do... ...than the, uh, stall strat. Okay, uh, where should I put this? Okay, lucky for me. Chat, I, uh, I wasn't showing it to say, spare your sensibilities, but, uh, I may or may not have been rappling the entire time. Yeah, rappling.
over on NA, I have been using Rapples to farm the NA event. Have I tipped you too much money? No, rest assured, this is something that would have happened regardless. The gears were already in motion. Listen, I don't have, like, I don't have apples to spare on NA. I think I destroyed them all back in, um, back with the summer event, probably. No, not with the summer event. Well, I mean, I just, I destroyed all my rapples during the summer event. <laughs> not for playing the event, though. Oh, it's her. Oh, shit. Oh, Oh, let's go, I guess. You're spending all night grailing BB to 120? Ugh. Holy shit. Okay, well, let's go. Uh, let's see. Why is the moon up there? Oh. Well, well, listen, maybe it's like, uh, she's like doing the Vegeta strat. Where she fucking shoots a laser up into the sky and it acts as an artificial moon. Thus activating her powers of turning into a giant gorilla. I gotta say, even at my uh, relatively modest NP level, <laughs> modest, I say. Like, I'm actually really impressed with like how fucking hard Kagetora hits. Like how consistent she is despite being a single target ruler. Gastoria is better? Well, yeah, she's a fucking berserker. And a uh, saber face. So I suppose she's bound to be good. So wait a second. 
Oh, that's right. Kagetora is a Takeuchi face. But not a saber face. Also, what the fuck? All these moon cans are sleeping on the job. Yeah, let's fucking go. Full cancer. One of the SRs you pulled in your Digimon TCG was Talalak. What does a Talalakmon look like? So what about Artoria Lily? Listen, Artoria Lily is really good for a three star. She's so good they gave her an extra rating. Or have a harem of Mordreds. The piglets grew up in a Mordred? That's horrifying. Can you imagine Mordred talking like a boar piglet? What is this, Tlalakmon? Looks like Ascension Shrubbery. Okay, show of hands chat. Who here has never had the misfortune of reading the second half of Summer 1? Ah, you guys are lucky. You guys are very, very lucky. Dude, Summer 1? It was... It, it looked like such a fun event. And it was for the first half. Then the boar start talking. Okay. So that takes care of section 11. She was as it was, dude. We have full meter? Yeah, I'm still trying to think of a, a goal to put in in the bit slot. I'm trying to fill out the... Fill out the wheel. Yo, chat. You know what? Let me ask you guys, what was your... 
What would you say your favorite stream was from recent memory? I can get some ideas there. Oh god, what is all this shit? No, you know what? I reject I reject this plan. I'm going to go with a different one. We're going to go with plan A. We're going to go with plan double A. Oh, the crowns. Oh, the servant crowns. God. That's all that works. The gotcha roulette one. Gotcha game roulette, huh? You know what? Let me write that one down. Soul Calibur 6. Oh, I'm glad you guys got a kick out of that one. What the fuck? Oh, we're fighting the BB boy toys. Okay. Let me think about this. So I want to actually NP on this turn. Just so we can get some action going. So let's do this. You like the extra playthrough? Ah. Golf. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Okay, it's too late. I'm not restarting. No, it's fine. This time I'll get it right. As if you only have two skills? I don't fucking know. It's dumb. <laughs> Which I like better. I like BB Dubai's uh, like look better. But BB Cosmos is pretty cool too. A Tekken version of Soul Calibur 6? Yeah, that'd be cool. I don't think, um, I don't know how robust the character creation is for Tekken. I think it's just customizing the existing ones. Extella? Oh, Dahanic, I've actually played Extella. Uh, the story for Extella, like original Extella, is really good. But the actual gameplay is like turbo trash. You mean, your character look like Hitler? Ah. No, not extra. Extella. Extella. Extella 1 is the Musou game, but it's one where, like, the map is entirely segmented and enemies keep spawning in your rear for completely arbitrary reasons. As opposed to, like, actual Musou games where enemies also spawn in your rear for arbitrary reasons, but at least it's sort of, it's sort of, like, couched in the idea of enemies arriving from, like, other parts of the country. Which at least I can buy, right? A fucking plant spawning out of nowhere and dumping enemies in your rear. That I don't buy. Good damage moves. Extella Link played better, but it had a trash fucking story, dude. If you like Charlemagne in this game, you're not gonna you're not gonna like Extella Link. 
It's so shit, dude. I really want to NP, but NPing is a waste. I should just pop the guy's bar. Alright, let's go. There's a trend of taking characters from terrible fate projects and giving them redemption arcs in an FGO event? You're not wrong. Like, I think, yeah, Sieg was absolutely the biggest version of that. Because he was fucking nothing. Nothing in APOC. I called him Fates Kiriyamato, and like, it, he fucking earned that in APOC. The Sakura 5 of their entire development in FGO? I'll have to play CCC. That's interesting. I thought they would feature more prominently. Was Tlaloc always dressed like a bunny? Yeah, I think she was. Never mind. Carry on. Oh, God. Hold on. What if I gave him some of the old 1 2 Arquade Brunstead? Play the event for the sixth time. No, God, not that one. Well, please. Gong her? Poor Quaid, I thought you were a fan. How could you betray the Brun like this? <laughs> Mash. Well, I suppose that works too. Listen, if we run into any assassins, I'm doing it. This reminds me of that fucking boss. Oh shit, class disadvantage. Okay. Like, there's that fucking boss in uh, Ordeal Call 2. That stupid bird you gotta fight, like. I think for multiple consecutive encounters. Dude, that fight sucks. Alright, have a good one, Hollow Name. I don't even remember the bird being harder. It's really annoying. Oh, it's the same model, just without all the darkness. Uh. Or I, I, I'm pretty sure the one in it was shrouded in darkness. Maybe I'm crossing my wires, but I feel like that was the case. The Thunderbird, yes, it was called the Thunderbird. I remember that event had like some, uh, it had some like wild hunt shit as well. Remember, not event, that chapter. 
God, I should have brought a Lancer! It's okay, guys. The, tr the real hero enters the story now. And I figure it's only fair that we give her the last word. All right, do your thing, Kukul Khan. That is going to use GGG. Honestly, that's also that's also clever. I should have done that. Okay. We're getting there, we're getting there. Plenty through chapters, man. I've really bitten off more than I could chew with this one. We've been farming embers for so long. Yeah, not all right. Hey, have a good one, Donic. Thank you very, very much for stopping by, good sir. Hope you have a good week. I'm halfway through part two. Damn. Well, hey, at least we're uh, moving smoothly. Should you do the funny or leave chat edged? Ooh. Oh, hey, it's him! Hakuno Kishinami. You know what? I'm gonna plead the fifth. Okay, well, I mean, surely Hakuno just does this thing right here. Oh! Oh! Okay! Interesting! So he... I don't I have no idea what the fuck that did, but it trades his NP bar for a shuffle on a one-turn cooldown, and it seems like... It's just a regular shuffle. Not like a specific card one, huh? But it's on a one turn cooldown. Which tells me that either it goes up to zero turns at level 10, or I can combine it with the CDR to exploit that. It's zero Alright, I don't know what the fuck any of this says. I'll hold off on that. I'm a little short. Yeah, let's just attack. Let's 
術量イコール破壊力ですどこにいようと逃がしませんお覚悟のほどよろしいですかクルカン移動しましょう Okay, skill 3 increases his damage against specific attributes, depending on which option you pick. It's a stars per turn effect and up to 30% charge. Oh, interesting. Oh. Yo, what the fuck? Is this Worm Castoria? Hot. Also, I have no idea what fucking alignment this thing is. Tag the enemy too late. Moratoria, Okay, so I've heard about this. This is the anti anti enforcement defense buff. But it doesn't work on evades, right? What? You can just summon Charlemagne? And Nero? Yo! Okay, that's pretty fucking cool. And the big Altera? Yo, okay, okay, I like this. This is fucking sick. God damn. Oh my god, he just ate his. Yo! What does that mean? Who made that racket? I need to find the source of that. Yeah, God, holy shit. All right, tell you what, chat. I'm gonna do this. Hold on. Uh, let's see. There you go. You know what? I'll spin it next time, and I'll leave it as unknown for the time being. There you go. At least until I uh, figure out what I what I want to put on here. Ah, oh, what is this, Rio? Interesting. Wait, did I... I kind of feel like that's a fight where I didn't have to use Mash, and I did anyway. Oh, it's this fucking bird again. Sorry. Actually, you know what? Let's just go for it. 
Don't go for that other buster. No. Go for the mighty. Yeah, I think that sound was me. It might be because I swapped emulators for JP somewhat recently. Because my old NA or my old JP emulator was um, it was crashing like a comical amount. Although this new one seems to have some issues with its uh, Google Play integration, so I'm keeping the old one around just in case. Okay. It pl paid off gameplay-wise? Oh yeah, dude. I don't think we've had like a normal... Like a standard crash this entire time. Okay. I gotta decide. Do I want to Kugel con this? Or do I want to Alco this? Ah, oh, decisions, decisions. What do you think, chat? You want to see Kuku Moldy? Alright, let's fucking go for it. See a cuckoo showcase? Alright. Let's go fuck him up. Unfortunately, my cuckoo con has its uh, servant coins in a bit of an odd place. So, you know what? I'll, I'll run Alco as backup just in case this fight goes to shit. Also, I've been kind of peeking ahead, and it seems like the final fight, unless I'm mistaken, happens in section 17? Is that true? What the fuck? Oh, never mind. There's, there's a, there's, the info's just not filled out. Never mind. There's like one fight per chapter in the later ones. Okay, well, that's good to know. All right, let's go. Oh, Echon, I've got a surprise for you. All right, see you, Tempest. Have a good one, dude. Why are we in a cake forest? Where else would you fight that, Chan? Oh my god! Oh 
事とはいえ、私も女ですので、実利、成績、そして趣味を優先で楽しむ。ええー。Who am I? Good or just weird? What do you mean? Oh, you mean, um. The. Queen Light's the Assassin Queen. She's really good. She's a meta support. Oh, yeah, no, she's absolutely outstanding. What is this? Why do they want me to run Oberon for this? Oh, okay, I think I know why. That should probably go first. Okay, so they probably want me to swap out, if anything. Yeah, no, a lot of Buster Servants, you can just abuse their cooldown. Make them stack buffs like crazy against bosses and uh, loop against standard encounters. Oh, fuck. Well, now you know who the cakes are for. Oh, I didn't bring the right plug suit. Alright, hold on. Nope, not the one I wanted. Okay, well, let's fuck around a little bit, I guess. Okay, there we go. I said, like, she's from a flash game. You mean Koi and Dark? I mean, Koi and Dark's okay. I don't really use her all that much, but to my understanding, she's like. She's like decent, but not particularly exemplary. My opinion is that her gimmicks are spread a little too thin. At least for my taste. Ah, beautiful. Let's see. King Party Alter does not act for one turn every two turns. Oh, so she's got like Truant. Huh. Echan doesn't feel so good. Oh, 
オルトリアクサクイーン破壊我こそは銀河を冠する古の王なればダイヤドクロスグレートアトラクトメジャーそして不愉快ですかっこよくそのとおりとああ、OK。No NP。Oh, I know why she looks weird. She doesn't have her stupid hat on. I thought something was missing. The sleep deprived version? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got like the bags under her eyes. Ah, kinda. Okay. <laughs> It's a weird fight. <clears throat> Dude, imagine how much it sucks doing these fights without extra classes. I remember when I was uh, building up this account, there were so many times where I would encounter a fight where I thought, oh man, if only I had a half-decent foreigner. And this was like before I had Kukul Khan. So I had a bunch of like low NP level AoEs that were just generally not appropriate for the fight. All right, we are past chapter 13. Imagine if you couldn't use Avengers in the story. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. That would fucking suck. Yeah, honestly, I feel like Avestion's a character that you really, really want to have. Just because of the anti-alter ego thing. Was inevitable. Hey guys, I think I've realized why uh, Eresh's affection is at zero.
What, what do they mean by this? <laughs> Could it be that we're fighting someone weak to Avengers? Oh, actually! I was thinking of just using Dantes, but honestly, I should probably keep uh, Erise available just in case that it goes to shit. Okay, so I want to run a Scotty and also swap in a Caster Scotty. We could also use that to get rid of Dobrynia. Okay. I think if I do it this way, I'll be okay. Oh, where the fuck did I put it? There it is. Alright. That's a lot of health bars. I forgot how fucking... I forgot how fucking big Dantes is. Jesus Christ. What an absolute chungus. Okay, the damage is still there. That's good. <laughs> that refund, though. Ah, oh, nine percent on a Buster is not bad. It's good. Okay. So what's luck of the draw on this one? Aries say cards. Okay, let's do this then. I don't think Aries say would loop even if I hit that. So what I should do instead is probably go this to try and get a uh, to try and get enough charge for Dantes to complete his own bar. Mm, not quite. Damn. Oh, okay, that, that'll do it. You've got to do both ZZZ events and they both end in six hours. Good luck. Holy shit. Alright, round two, motherfucker. You know what, this time? Let's go the inverse. Mm, that's not what I meant by the inverse. I mean, surely I can just... 
good. Good. Actually, you know what? Let me do this. Because I feel like charge is going to be a bigger a bigger problem than my survivability. Imagine not having Avengers for this. Dude, Avenger was like another big hole in my roster for the longest time. It's because like the gap between the really good Avengers and like the... The sort of like one note Avengers, it's pretty big. Hey, Jamzel, thank you for the 57 months. You lived off Domino's for two weeks, now send for help. Jesus Christ, how often are you ordering? これなる少なびこのより狩り受けし波の方に乗り来たる Oh, jeez. Doesn't take much damage, does she? I suppose that's on account of that buff she had. Okay, now what do I do? Uh, let's get the attack off going first. I think it might be more important. Okay, there we go. Good pop. God, she's so big! She's fucking thick! You know, let's just do this. Maybe a little premature, but I think I'd rather do that than risk losing very safe prematurely. Ah, uh, I should have realized this was another play grab ass fight. Sit on my ass for three turns. Oh, shit. I mean, I can do that at least. But that MP's gonna hurt. Yeah. 
Oh. Okay. So she doesn't absolutely massacre you. I'm gonna do this. Because I wanna play to survive. Until I get my boss back up. あれのさあ、幕を開けて。Okay. We did it. Love triumphs yet again, chat. And by love, I mean Arise violently hurling himself across the sea. Alright, I believe that's the end of part two, huh? Not bad, not bad. Now we just have the final gauntlet. Although to my understanding, most of the fighting happens in the next two chapters. Actually, no. Section 17, I think, is where the... Like, between now and Section 17 is when the bulk of the fighting happens. Oh. The Millennium Castle's open, huh? Now, BB Inflation, no. We're gonna finish the fight. Yeah, you know what? How about a lip for luck? Fuck! <laughs> That's not good. That's a bad omen. Where's that fucking Malaysi? There it is. I don't know if I'm ever going to use it, but I may as well have it. Because it's such a rare effect. <clears throat> okay. Uh, you know what? Uh, well, we'll put that to the side for the moment. You can have an idea. I really have no riders? Nah, dude. Who's my best rider, even? Is it Shingen? It might actually just be Shingen. I have, like, a, an old Kentucky, I think, that I have, uh... Grilled to some extent. Or maybe not. My strongest riders are... Shingen and Andromeda, is that right? Holy fuck. The game says Europa? No. No, there's no fucking way. Why are they picking Europa? What's wrong with this game? Anyway. What am I going to ride with? Oh, 
Jeez, what a pain. What a pain! Why isn't BB starred? The, don't worry about it. That one shouldn't be there either. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm just gonna have our Quaid go along. There you go. Double K scope magic. Flawless. God, there's so many fights in this chapter. Holy shit. Okay, so there's six after um, the next. So there's six in like 19 onwards. <laughs> Jeez, there's four in seventeen. Sixteen. And we're on fifteen. Okay, so including the fight we're currently on, that would make a total of eighteen fights. My JP account, my JP account is very lopsided because I have whaled on this account, as uh, Chai can attest to. But it's uh, on a few very specific servants, and I have like a lot of ones that I have just one of as testing. So I do whale on this account, but it's not like... It's not nearly to the same extent as my NA account. Wait, not a quaid, not a quaid, yes! Oh, she's a 30% her fucking hell! Fine. And then NA became my main account. Oh, I intended that from the beginning. The second I learned that an NA server was starting, I decided that my NA account would be a main account. Although it was a lot easier because by the time I got into FGO, I believe um, I had missed a lot of the early, early events. Like, I came in towards the end of year one, I want to say. Like, towards the latter part of year one. Because I got in around the time that the K and K event was ending, like the initial run of the K and K event was ending. I think that's when I got in, or maybe when Rashomon was ending.
Ooh. Okay. You know what? Let's go. It's the dwarf sperm whale. This account, yeah? I mean, you're not wrong. I'm just gonna end as is. I need to save my other buffs for the fights to come. Because this is effectively a four turn fight. No, it is a four turn fight. This fucking bird. Little prick. It was normal sized bird? No fucking way. You want to play that game? Let's play that game. Here. I'm not going to be able to use this after this turn. Favorite silly enemy name? Oh, Robot Senpai, where's your evidence, Senpai? I'm gonna give you a penalty, Senpai. <laughs> Thank you for the 50 bits, Mystic. Mellow plays reverse card, hell yeah. Bad hand to draw, but we can make two. I kind of think Zhufu would bite it. Clearly, my fault for not esportsing. I can't think of an enemy name, but probably one of my favorite things, like in terms of just weird text on screen, is um, you guys remember the Kotaro fight from Summer 4? The uh, challenge quest, where he summons a clone. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. And, like, when you defeat the main body, with the clone still alive on the field, the clone goes... Sayonara, but it's written in English and it's widely spaced and it vanishes. I remember that.
いつかもっと早く名もなき勝者だった両親未明の領域二刀の世界に組み上げ月のまなざすべての道を踏破するよし There's an Ozzy Mandy, yes, that's like there's no limit that can stop my speed. Huh. I don't remember that one. Uh, there's also the Gorgon Sisters fight in one of the Gilfest events where they summon Medusa, and Medusa is just labeled as a big shield. I remember that one. Actually, hold on. Oh, you know what? I'm going for it. I'm fucking going for it. It's been a while, hasn't it? I very rarely have a good excuse to take uh, the OG Suzuka goes in out. But this is a perfect opportunity. Yo. Got Venus Driver going. Hell yeah. I don't actually know if any of these scale. Whatever, we'll find out. Speaking of someone, oh yeah, this is where the challenge quest happens, huh? Oh, God. All right, you know what? Let's fucking go. All right, let's see the fabled Hakuno Mighty Chain. Oh, there's Casco. Oh, wow, okay. Are we going to see Gilgamesh, though? That's my question. Nah, no Gil. Not the full spectrum, though. You got Charlemagne, Altera, the Three Fate Extra Trio. How many gotcha salt that you need to pull CL? Uh, a lot. It's brutal. Yes. Oh, let's go. Okay. If we go Buster Buster, we might get something different. Let's try that. 
り切る No, his Buster. Okay. So if we go Buster, Buster. If we go Buster to start, it's Gilgamesh. But if we chain into a Buster, it's it's a uh, Nero. An Arts card? No. Uh, we tried the Arts card last time. I mean, we chained into it, I think. Oh. <laughs> Did you fucking see that? Dude, I didn't notice it until I saw the animation slow down. <laughs> she fucking blocks with Neko Arc. Oh, okay, we started with Saber this time. Maybe you're right, maybe it is random. Yeah, you're thinking it might be tied to specific cards like codes? That there is a way of testing that. Not with this one, but... If that happens to be the case, there is a way of testing that. Once we actually unlock Hakuno. Oh, God. Smashu. All right. Let's fucking go. Essential one, the mean one. If I understand my melty blood correctly, yes. That is the actual archetype Earth that appears in the fighting games. She's taking it pretty well. Oh yeah, after all this time they finally worked our crate into a story, huh? Wait a second, two years after her release, huh? Ah, the rule holds. Three is the NTR free arcade, I see. But what if I want the second one? Oh, here we fucking go. 
All right, surely I can just pick neither, right? Fuck. Well, let's whine. It's fine, we got this. Chat, I'm gonna show you true power. Go. Who's fucking dead? So let's uh let's make the most of what we got here. You know, I really should change Kagatora to a different look. I don't really care for the third ascension. At least I think this is the third ascension. Okay, we got an arts book. What's the catch? Okay, Jufu down. Jufu down. Next up is this one. I'm gonna pop this defense buff, because I suspect I may need it shortly. My fortune comes from the heaven. My armor strength and my feet I think the NP animation looks really cool. I just don't really care for the uh the massive uh the massive Kunkle backpack. I mean, at the very least, we can continuously purge the volatile buffs that, that uh, she has. I suppose that's a relief. Oh, what the fuck? No, I reject this timeline. God damn it. She'll always purge on this bar? Fuck me. Uh... Okay, there is a way out. There is a way out.
Yeah, we let Castoria run her course this turn, then attack next turn. Oh, but yes, yeah, so thank you for the 45 months, Mr. Jerry. Hope you're doing well. All right. So my boss expired this turn, so I feel like I should get at least a little bit of damage going. Oh, good. My third hand managed to actually get a run in. And almost exhaust my entire... My entire stock of rabbles. Jesus Christ. Good. Just need to not die here. Okay, good. Kagator can take the crit. I'm fine with that. Okay. Let's get a little frisky with it. Okay, we have about, like... Yeah. Okay, I shouldn't use anything else, right? Because we get purged. I just need to get my charge back up. Oh! <laughs> Two hundred percent on a single arts card. Oh, don't kill my Castoria, I kind of need that. Oh, don't kill that, I really need that. Okay. Let's go. Good. We have just enough to get this working. Okay, if Castoria survives, I have a pretty good... I have a pretty good shot next turn. Oh, just kidding, she's at full charge. Castoria's fucking dead. Alright, what's my back line? Okay. I'm going to do this just so I can make sure I have something for next turn. Alright, let's go. My fortune comes from the heaven. My armor shines on my chest. And my feet is from the Oh, that's nasty. Mm -hmm. 
Wait, I can do it! Oh, maybe I can't. Hold on. I might need a reset. Is your purge better than mine? No! <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Sorry guys. I was operating under FGO AI for a second there. Man, oh man. Okay. Well, with my newfound wisdom. First try, question mark, baby. Yeah, I can imagine this fight kind of fucking sucks if you don't have a stacked ruler, huh? I mean, I feel like if your Estrella is tricked out enough, you could probably get away with it. So oh, tear. Cats, cats might be a little difficult. Oh, you feel like the crit buffs are the problem? Oh, that's like, I guess that's what makes Kagetora so effective against her, huh? It's because uh, her offense can't really ramp up. No, no, I've been to that place. I've been to that place. I know what that is. Have any of you guys ever watched uh, Summer Kiara's Valentine's? You go there. Also, what the fuck is this? Get, get BB out. No! <laughs> what the fuck? All right, fine. Damn, Beebs. Maybe I could use my own beep. Hold on. <gasps> Blue note, you fucking genius. Where is my beep? Oh. 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 And this is my own Bart, huh? Can I? 
swap you out. How could no? Okay, let's go. Man. Okay. So to my understanding, these next two sections, 16 and 17, have the bulk of the encounters in this chapter. Or in this third of the chapter. So once we're past chapter 17, we should mostly be down to boss battles. Like a couple of small boss battles. <laughs> Oh, jeez. I don't really like that. I don't really like any of this. I feel like I should just let Kiara NP and put this out of my misery. Unfortunately, no. Uh, we can work with this. All right, let's go. Whoa! Wait, how can I gonna survive, isn't he? They really did bring out every moon cancer for this, huh? Entire thing is anti ruler. Well, that's not our entire thing, but that's one of our passes. Oh my god, please, someone for the love of god, kill Bart. <laughs> Please! No! It's fine. I prepared for this. Yo, Karna's with uh, Kiara. This is some like advanced Geneco cook over here. This is fucked. Poor, poor Jinako. We get some tea. Dude, after Alice pointed it out, I can't fucking unsee. I can't. <laughs> I can't unsee BB just fucking letting a fart rip during her space NP. Absolutely ruined. <laughs> I 
The big rap. No, it's fine. Our true team has got this. <laughs> <laughs> Can Quinn even do 8k? <laughs> Alright, we did it. How's it going, Ryasu? Alright. Yes, I'll take the Zhufu, please. Okay, so this is an alter ego. We want a pretender. I have one really good pretender. Naturally. Okay, let's do it like this. There we go. Whatever, I'll just let Lady Avalon sit on Golden Zuma for a little bit. What are my thoughts on this year's summer lineup? I think the choice of servants, like, good enough. Talaluk was natural. Uh, Zhu Fu is unexpected but much appreciated. BB was good. Like, if it, we're talking about servant choice, I think they did miss a few, like, good ones. Like, they missed Kukul Khan, they missed, um... Passion Lip Passion was a pretty big exclusion. Yeah. Hey, how's it going, Breaker? I shouldn't have done that. That was actually really bad. I just realized something about this fight. I lose my offensive boss when I do that. Oh, that's ass. It's fine though. I think we can accumulate enough damage to finish the fight. Oh, 
テファイスティオン史上最も偉大なる征服を見つかんだる第一の復讐なるオカキックホイール We got her Ladies and gentlemen Victory Oh, what is this shit? Okay, 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 oh god, okay, hold on. Is there any year one slash two servant you feel that they missed? Well, okay, let's, uh, I suppose before I answer that question, I sh we should establish what, the, what you consider to be the end of year two. Okay, I have a I have a solution. So we keep all our important shit in the back line. Yeah, hey, speaking of media, I think we're going to need her because I I learned something about this fight. I suppose the rest doesn't really matter. Could be fucking Ivan. BB's second buff strips? Oh. Well, hey, it works for me. 500 years, don't, don't worry about it. I was working under the assumption that this was like the uh, big Kiara fight. Because that's kind, of, that's kind of the impression that I'm getting looking at this fucking effect list. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to swap in Kagetora. Because we have to play grab ass for a few turns. There we go. Honji Suijak, Leki Hanamits, Hapo no Shogai, so no Sibete or Uketo Memasho. Oh, Jesus Christ. Tell <laughs> Okay, well, I suppose it's up to me to define the end of year two then. So I will say up until the last 
the last epic of Remnant ended, which was Salem. So that year covers up to Hokusai. Okay, I gotta wait one more turn. Let's see, summer servants that we missed. Summer shooten. That's a big one, right? Yeah, no, we never had a summer shooten. We had Onikir. And we had summer Ibuki. But no summer shooting. We had summer Ibaraki even. Summer Serenity. Uh, has she finally done it? No, we gotta wait. I think. We had Summer Illy and Chloe. We need a Summer Ellie. Summer Cats? Eh. Yo, Summer Gorgon! Summer Gorgon, Summer Taiga. All right, let's fucking go. Yeah, get fucked, Kiara. Now it gets ugly. No, not the beep. Honestly, I could have just done it with Kagetora, come to think of it. <laughs> ah, whatever. Save you the trouble, I guess. Do you get KP points this time? God forbid. Yo, Summer Sherazad, Summer Penthesilia. There's a lot of really good options from year one and two. Summer Oki! Dude, Summer Osakabahime! Or how about this? Here's my pitch. A Summer Mecha Ellie that's just a speedboat. Or a submarine. You get to pick. It's a pair of welfares. You get to pick between the speedboat and the submarine. Oh god, we do have Oki! Oh, oh, now I'm, now I'm sad. I never use Oki. No, no, I actually forgot about Oki. I mean, she has one very on paper cool gimmick that very, very rarely comes into play. Almost never in like normal gameplay. It's only abuse from intern nonsense. Yeah, to get around like taunters and stuff, if I recall. Dude, we could have gotten the summer Cersei. Stop regenerating your fucking bar, Kiara. Jesus Christ, let me play the game. No? Okay, never mind. Uh, we'll call it a mulligan. Alright, good game, Kiara.
Summer Hoki is way too thin. How she would be canonically. Dude, she has the, the Moe syndrome. Where, like, uh, they showed a swimsuit Moe in Blue Archive, and she's like, she looks all, like 180 degrees different from, like, the default one. Alright, see you, Sonic Brandon. Have a good one, dude. Alright, who else are we missing, Summer-wise? Yo, Summer Stolf? Where's the Summer Stolf at? That's free money! It's a fucking printing machine. Neza? No, no one's gonna fucking buy a Summer Neza. No fucking way. They they'd have to put Neza as like the booby prize on like a good like a good banner. Like the rate up on Summer Passion Lip is gonna be like split with like a Summer Neza or something like something like that. Oh, okay. Sure. Okay, I have, a, I have a pitch. Summer nursery rhyme, but it's just the book form in a plastic bag. Don't underestimate the five Neza Sims. I would question whether there's more than one Neza Sim on the planet. He's popular in FGO. If Neza wasn't, I would be shocked. There's some pretty grody designs, but I think Neza is like easily bottom five. Sachin trying to become relevant. Literally, they could have made Neza like a Sachin pseudo servant, and that'd be more intriguing than the Neza in the game. Neza in this game exists solely to job. Remember, Lost Girl 4 starts with her jobbing to herself, and then the evil Neza that defeated our Neza all then proceeds to job. Well, yeah, other good candidates for summer servants. Oh, shit. Oh, no, we're safe. God, I thought that was going to end badly. She should have been Go West. I I, I kind of get the distinct impression in Go West that no one outside of Xuanzang actually really does anything. Then again, the event was very short at the time. Well, yeah, for other server servants, you got Drake. You got, um... Oh! Here's one they never bothered to do. Summer... Summer Artemis. Summer Tomacat? Summer Tomacat, I think, would sell. Yeah, Summer Media would have sold...
Summer Alt we never had a Summer Altera. Huh. We already have Summer Tamamo. Listen, they I feel like they're very loose. About like multiples of a summer servant. Think of how many summer Artorias we've had, right? And they know they sell like hotcakes. I think they could have gotten away with selling. Oh, for fuck's sake, what do they want from me this time? Hold on. Oh, we're doing this shit again, huh? All right, hold on. God, how am I gonna get this swap in? This is so annoying. I'll just do this, I guess. Yeah, whatever. If the others become relevant, so be it. Oh yeah, let's work backwards. We've had Summer Echon. Um Summer Summer Castoria. Summer Double X. Or Summer MHX, I guess, technically. We've had Bunny Toria. I got it in reverse order, but whatever. We've had Maid Altar. We've had Squirtoria. So that's at least six. We've had at minimum six. Like, separate Artorias as Summer Servants. I'm struggling to think of a summer where we didn't get an Artoria. The Summer Camp one, I guess. Let's go. <laughs> Ten go. Oh yeah, Summer Morgan. I mean, she's not Artoria. She's a saber face, but she's not. Actually, I don't know if she even counts as a saber face. She should. Literally the same face. Oh, are we immune to the effect? Oh, we are. Holy shit. Oh, I forgot. Kagator transforms into a third attention for everything. Ladies and gentlemen, we got her. Oh, we're getting there. 
We are most of the way through the most combat heavy chapter. Or section of this chapter. I still gotta farm embers after this. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me. I mean, is the event ends? There's a bit less than a week, I think. It's either a week or less than a week. All right, see you, Lavenders. Dude, I thought this was a short chapter that's mostly dialogue. Maybe it is mostly dialogue, but holy shit. Oh, what is this? So by my count, there should be... It's one, two, three, four. Okay, so there should be eight battles total remaining. I mean, I should count backwards, maybe. No, no I think it's eight battles total. Okay. Listen, Bart's like Nasu, man. He can't resist giant woman. We should have known. I should have known this would be the correct amount. She doesn't even have bangs. She's got bangs of a different sort. Why won't you die? Oh yeah, this is the first time she's actually become huge, huh? Unless I'm mistaken. No, no, she was huge at the previous fight. But she kept regenerating, never mind. She's always been huge. Now she's really getting huge. She's huge. She is massive. The most massive friend on the planet. Okay, with my dying breath, I kill Bartholomew Roberts. Kiara translates from being a boss to a playable unit. I think they've been way too conservative with her, like, damaging abilities up until this point. Because the issue with Alter Ego Kiara, and to a lesser extent, Moon Hands of Kiara, like, up until the most recent buff. Oh, shit. 
Is that... Like, she struggles to... Kill enemies at a reasonable NPA level. Because she has so much of her kit dedicated to utility. But also, the, another issue is that if they wanted to make her a pure survivability unit, there was a way of doing that. Like, we saw a Jinoko turned out. She's a pure survivability unit. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. She has an actual NP, and it's dunking us into Mountain Dew. どうやら綺麗は気づいていないのかなすでに遠い姿勢を失ってブラックタンティーパーティーハウリングどうやって私の秘密を暴いたのですああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ
Do I re-roll? Uh, maybe I shouldn't. We only have so much charge to work with. No, let's do it. Okay. One's good. I'll take it. Oh, what is this shit? Really? She couldn't just fucking... Uh... She's gonna make me do it again? What an asshole. Oh, they're going buffs, I guess. Alright, one more. One more. Whatever, at the very least, Kagetaro will be stocked right now. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> you like your animation update? Good, she needed one. I approve. Oh, they redid her laugh too. Oh, thanks to Lala. All right. I mean, regardless of how we do this, I'm going to need to NP this turn. So let's take care of that. You gotta do it just to get rid of her shit. Considering we had, like, one buff for that, not bad. If I have good enough face cards, I could probably just crit her down this turn. Uh, maybe not with that. One. Okay, not quite a mighty chain. Oh, let's try it. What's she got? She is. Oh, beast. She's beast, isn't she? Yeah. Well, that's a problem. Oh, maybe we can make something happen. Hey! Glorious Kagetora. Oh, okay, that's that's not great. Oh, maybe it's good though. Oh shit! It's gonna suck. Does Hakuno's Envy give me any kind of protection? 
mal. No, it's offensive. It has a chance to stun. Okay, fuck it, I guess. Let's go. Oh no, she can't be stunned. Alright, whatever. Let's go for damage then. My fortune comes from the heaven. My armor is from the mountains. And my feet is from the earth. Listen for sure. Shiranoi! Yeah, I mean, considering we're operating at a fraction of our damage. Yeah, I think we've made remarkable headway. Alright, well. Time to do the do. <laughs> okay, Kagetora survived, but for how long? Actually, she did that pretty well. All things considered. That buff removal, the buff block is going to be a problem, bro. Unless... Hold on. Oh, I don't even was the most recent one. God damn it. How annoying. Oh, it's fine. もう死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死ぬ。死
Yo, we fucking did it. Good lord. Dude, we are systematically fighting every Moon Cancer. I think the only one we haven't fought in some form so far is Juniko. Because we had the unwinnable fight against BB earlier, which I'm guessing we're going to have a rematch. Listen, if you find any weird cubes in the sky or otherwise, we got to take a peek. Did we fight the statue? I don't know. If we did, I don't recall. Oh, we are getting there. Holy fuck. Is pure skip material? Thank fuck. Okay, so in the remaining... Oh. Oh, that's quite a lewd-looking tower. In the remaining chapters, up until 22, I believe there are only six fights total. So fucked. I am so fucked. I really said I'd be farming embers until we hit level 118, huh? What was I thinking? So, you lads up for an all-nighter? I'm not. I had stuff I wanted to get done tonight. God damn it. I just need this fucking chapter to end. It's so long. The inflation all nighter, let's go. <laughs> Okay, I have no idea what's in this fight. Let's go. Mm, okay, I'm, I'm starting to suspect I know what's in this fight. Again? Alright, fine. So this is one of six. Excuse me, why does she have the moon as a break bar? What's that supposed to mean? Alright, whatever, let's go. I mean, we got to Brynja, let's use the Brynja. Alright, see Ryasu.
Okay, that's one. You know, I have a feeling I sh maybe shouldn't use Jufu. Let's try and deeps here. Whatever. Let's have Dabrinya go in for another round. <laughs> okay, we're getting there. One more. Alright, against all odds, Jufu survives. We did it? Question mark? Oh, okay, no. It specifies this one's a restricted formation, as opposed to every other restricted formation fight in this chapter. Naturally. It's a more restricted. You may not come because this one. Okay, Barty's probably going to be the least useful one here, so naturally I draw his cards first. Edge on! Alright, I'll take an edge on. All right, have a good one. Wait a fucking second. Your name's been Viagra and Joy this whole time? That's what Twitch's fucking name in parentheses things tells me. What the fuck? <laughs> This one, let's go Percival. Actually, let's just do this. I feel like Echon's gonna be doing most of our heavy lifting anyway. It's pretty crazy that they managed to work the summer event into like an actual like main story chapter. It's pretty wild. 
Okay, last shot. All right, two beeves down. So we're now a third of the way through the final fights of the game. Oh, naturally. We gotta break the moon. We gotta piss on it. Can I just... I can! Can I just... Yeah, okay. Let's fucking go. One more for Kagetora. Dude, Kagetora has like... Even at NP2, she has absolutely wrecked shop in this chapter. Oh, she disabled order change, huh? Very clever. Unfortunately, I was prepared. I gotta say, Uesugi Kenshin is probably the coolest person to ever die on the toilet. Damn, okay. That is quite substantial. Wikipedia has a list for people who died in the toilet. Fucking really? What the fuck? Alright, break the moon. Break the moon. Show us. Yeah, she keeps cheating. Who's the first person to ever like regenerate their uh, break bar? Was it Kirstaria? I think um, I forget. There were cryptors 
that would give their servants additional break, like an additional break bar. In which case, they would, that would predate uh, Kerstaria. Maybe Kadok? I don't know if Kadok did it. Oh. It's not ominous. It was the Canis fight. All right, here we fucking go. This is number four. Oh. Oh. Can I use my own? Yeah! Can I use my own? Oh. <laughs> okay. Oops. My oh man, I might not have enough black rails for this. No, just kidding. That's a lie. Where the fuck did I put Jufu? There you are. Okay, well, suffice to say, I don't really want to use Moriarty here. I'll probably just keep quitting in case I have to actually use CL. She's not gonna order change lock me, is she? I'll be a little cross if she is. You know what? In case there's an actual order change lock going on, let me do it this way. Yeah, this way. Worst case scenario, I just have to wait for Kagatori to rotate in. Okay, so of the presumed six fights remaining in this chapter, we have done four of them. I believe this is number four. Dude, we really fucked this place up, didn't we? Sorry, Arash. It's Kagetora time. I bet she's gonna NP immediately. That sounds like a BB thing to do. Now, I don't know shit about this story and I don't want to know until the appointed time. But it'd be really funny if this BB were somehow related to that random BB Go character from the, like, the bonus section of CCC. Or sorry, the Seraph event.
霊気銀河解放時空が終わっても必ずあなたを捕まえるわエディンシュグラコラプサー遅いマックだって Yes good Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, she fucking bored that guy. Well. Less forward and more atomized, but still, holy shit. Let's fucking go! Oh, maybe not a... Yeah, okay, not quite a min turn. But we have absolutely wrecked her. My fortune comes from the heaven. My armor shines on my chest. And my history is going to be Vision Tatsu! Shinadoi! We did it! The Beeb is dead! Except for the part where she didn't disappear. Thank you for the 50 bits, Mystic. This has really become the Kagatora exhibition chapter, hasn't it? It absolutely has, dude. Like, it's... Kagatora's hard to beat. She loops pretty reliably. She does a shitload of damage. Purges buffs. The all-around anti-moon cancer. Okay... Oh, what, what's that up there? I swear to God, if twice, if twice HP's been shows up, I'm gonna be mad. Hold on a second, what the fuck is happening? Moon is haunted! <laughs> Thrice L Peaceman. Or I Peaceman, sorry. I was thinking of all the LCs. Oh, God. All right, chat. I'll be right back. Let me get a Red Bull. Oh, boy.
All right, let's go. Okay, so it's... I think I'll just let that be the, uh, the mandatory support. Okay, so I want to run the usual package. Usual suspects, we run Zhufu, we run Castoria, we run Kagetora. Then we run a backup, just in case. Who is my backup DPS? No, let's not do that. You know what? We'll have Estrella be the backup. Just in case it all goes to shit. Actually, if I'm going to do that, I should put it, give her the other Black Grail. I'll be right with the assault. Let me just set up this party. I'm thinking one way we could do it is to run a sacrificial frontline and just use like Jufu and stuff to force an early engagement. If I do it this way, I can force Castoria to save herself. Oh. Yeah, that link broke. As God is my witness, if I fall into a stupid amount of money, I'm salvaging the servant verse. Alright. What is this? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Fucking beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> I like it, it's fucking outstanding. You know what? I will run the swap code. Just in case I'm going to run the swap code. Alright, let's go. If the swap doesn't work, so be it. But I'm going to hope that it does. In which case, I could just plow through the early waves with like Estrella or something and then rotate in Kagetora. Moon Rise Obsession? What? Okay, thanks, Biebs. I guess I think that's the third ascension. Oh. What the fuck? Okay. I don't quite have the full amount of charge that I need for this. Maybe I should have just let that turn pass. Alright, let's try this to start. 
名もなき勝者いいですはいナイスグレディエント未明の領域未踏の世界組み上げ気を回す Enemy's name is just straight up Moon. Moon Cancer? Oh. Oh, hey. Apparently, the, the, the Moon Cancer、uh, can be stunned. This is the stage four moon cancer. What the fuck am I looking at? <laughs> Goodbye, <laughs> Jufu. <laughs> I like how the camera's just constantly zooming in and out because it's so huge. This is crazy, dude. Okay, here is my plan. Yeah, I think I can do this. We go like Kagetora, Hakuno, Kagetora. You have to see Tomoe's NB. So I don't know how this boss reacts to like model like adjusting animations, but I kind of feel like there is an invisible point that counts as the boss's hitbox that takes all the shit, and that throwing it around wouldn't actually do anything visually. That's my. That's what I suspect is the case. Just rolled fallacy. Oh, it has multiple NPs. Holy shit. It's getting a little dangerous, isn't it? I got to lost a card. Buster card. Doesn't help. Okay, well, let's do this just in case we get fucked. Alright, hold on. <laughs> worst comes to worst, we may have to finish the fight using、uh, Space Arresh. My fortune comes from the heaven. The alternative is that I can make sure that I have protection up for each of his breaks. Which might not be the easiest thing in the world, but it should be possible. It just means I need to run another support instead of、um, Estrella. Okay, what's the Just World thing this time? Belief in a Just World. Okay, Kagetora survived. Uh, just kidding. Not for long. Okay, we get one more shot with Kagetora. 
We gotta make it count. We go in with Kagetora, then we try and have Eresh finish it. Because uh, Kagetora is dead this turn. <laughs> Mr. Game and Watch? some cards. What do we lose? Busters. We lost a buster. Okay, we came, buddy. Yeah, I think I just need to take better care of my Castoria. That's probably the big ticket. Oh, I don't really do damage to this, do I? It may honestly be worth sacking Hakuno and Space Arresh. Just so I can, um, like, save a round of protection. That's unfortunate. Yeah, the fact that my supports got wiped out with the um the repeated brick bar NPs, that sucks. Yeah, so there's no point keeping a stray. I just need to keep more servants that can like null the uh, just world attacks. Alright, with my dying breath, I curse you. Honestly, while the pressure is low, I feel like it may be productive just to use Space Arrest. Okay. Oops, no. That's fine. Can I stick a bomb on Jufu? I don't know. I feel like the boss would cleanse. Although, if that worked, that'd be quite funny. Alternative, I could speedrun the early bars with, um, like, Astrea in the front line. Now, here's an important question. Does the boss immediately NP? Once I pop that guts, I suspect it does. So I feel like the team composition I want to aim for in the front line to lock that possibility out is to run like Kagetora, Castoria, um, Lady Avalon. That's my objective. Because I think with that combo, I can, I can lock the boss out of being able to kill me. So my goal is to establish this combo on the board. And to start the fight, we can run Jufu. Like Jufu, Hakuno, Eresh should be able to put up enough of a fight at the start for me to get my real team in. So I'm gonna gamble on that and also run this. Because I suspect I'm gonna need it. So our, my objective is to stop swapping and just sort of have a controlled burn of my front line. 
Although thankfully, I think Lady Avalon is the least necessary component of that front line, or of the back line. So if, like, we lose two members prematurely, that I can, like, adjust around that. What appalls me is that there's supposedly a fight after this. It's kind of fucking horrifying, isn't it? Okay, let's do this. Running Sun Cancer next? Oh. Okay, yeah, Sp Space Star should be able to take care of bar number one. Nard's card, unfortunate. You know, I mean, it might be worth going with the brave chain here. I'm gonna do it. Oh, that's not cleansable. Oh, interesting. That's well, good to know. I can still do this though. There we go. Okay, so that's what Hakuno is there for. I don't know if it's worth it to keep a resh into the next bar, but at the very least we can generate like a steady supply of 50 stars, if that's the case. That might be worth it. Oh god, that popped. Alright, now the real fight is on. Jufu was definitely expendable at this point, so I'm okay with that. Okay, so here I'm actually going to go out of my way to try and set up a Castoria NP chain. Yeah. This will shield us against the next Just World attack. That's a lot of damage. Damn. I don't think I can repeat the trick right away, though, although I guess that's fine. But I want to build it for the Castro MP anyway. Could have used it on Kestra for more stacks. I was thinking of using it on Kagetora for the NP game. 
Oh, never mind. I lost all my charge. Well, so much for that. Okay, so yeah, now we need to play grab ass for a little bit. I'm debating whether it's worth actually using Resh's invuln here. Just to try and build up to level 7. Ah, uh, level 7 doesn't really do anything, so maybe I shouldn't. No, let's hold it. We have like three turns to get something going. Still need Castoria to do something here. You know what? Let's do this. Okay. Okay, we have something going. Okay, well, I think we're good to go. Let's do it. I'm a little... I'm getting a little nervous at the chip damage I'm taking, but... I think we can make two. Okay, good. Alright, here we fucking go. Okay, story's getting a little long in the tooth. We can CDR her. That's worthwhile. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna sit on that third scale for the time being. I need a little more juice. But we can do this. Oh, jeez. Oh. Okay, hold on. I need to redo that. If the if Castoria is going to get crit that many times, I need to I need to just use that arts buff. Yeah. Aresha's presence on this front line is actually becoming an obstacle as the fight goes on. I don't believe my seed or my uh, cleanse is going to be off for a while, which is another problem. Yeah, I suppose I should save it for uh 
phase three, or sorry, the final phase. use that now. Better than losing it. This also means that if Castoria survives somehow, do some change RNG, I could chain her and he into Kagatoras to cleanse off that debuff. No skill! Okay. It's not ideal, but I can make something happen. Okay. Lady Avalon does not possess a cleanse. How long do these last for? That's two turns. Yeah, not having Castoria really sucks here. Oh, it's fine. We'll do it this way. Yeah, okay, so Kagetora, unless it's like a turn-based buff block, that should remove the stack. It's good damage, though. Considering uh, how many pieces we're missing. I gotta say, one thing that's really cool about Kagetora is just how much disruption she can play through. Like, if I put some cleanse codes on her, like maybe level up the first skill, put some cleanse codes on her, she'd probably work even better. Oh, is this guy just gonna keep doing that? That might be a problem. It's every turn. It's not infinite. It's eight turns? Okay. The fight's gonna be long over before that's relevant. So I gotta think about this carefully. And it's a one instance buff block, correct? Yeah, it's one stack. Okay. So here's what I can do. I think this is the ideal. If I'm gonna waste anything here, it should be this. Yes, okay. Good. Then we run this. So I have three pieces of protection I can use next turn. I'm going to hold on to all of them. Because I can get by without it this turn. I just need a way of stuffing the NP turn. That's the important part. Oh yeah, that's more than half. Holy shit. I think Kagetora's personal evade should be the first thing to go here. Okay. Then we do this to remove the rest. Okay. Then we use Lady Avalon. Okay. Let's fucking go. 
こればかりはやめられませんしやめませんよこのケイシンちゃんにお任せを How do I chain my damage here? We can't use that quick card. So that locks us out. Let's do this. My fortune comes from the hammer. My armor is made of energy. And my feet will break you. Is it over? Oh, that was a hard fucking fight. Dude, I, I it is shocking how much war Kagator was doing in this. NP2 even. Like, my Kagator is not, like, especially crazy either. Oh my god. Yeah, I want to know why the... Listen, two years from now, I'd love to know why the fuck that happened. I killed John Moon Cancer? Correct. I killed first name Moon, last name Cancer. Footage for the Kenjin Severn guy. Yeah, he is. He is open. All right. This uh, there's one fight left in this chapter, and it is two arrows from here. It is the middle of twenty one. So to everyone else who ended up doing that fight, what'd you what'd you guys use? Hold on. Just in case this is another fucking moon cancer, let me do this. I mean, it's gonna be a moon cancer. This is the moon cancer chapter. So let me just take care of this right away. Space arrest and blue cubes? Damn. Used four 120s in a row and barely one. No strategy if you're 120s? Jesus. Okay, she's at least foed. I was at least, uh... I had some presence of mind. Oh no, is it gonna be caster gems now? Okay, well, 6 10 10. Okay. Oh, I could freely pick a support. Well, who's the default? Mash? Mash. Okay, well, oops. Oh, I accidentally shoved my status bar to the top. There we go. Okay, yeah, let's get let's get a real support. I'm gonna assume I'm fighting Beebs. Or some variant uh, thereof. So what I'm going to do is I am going to... We're going to go in Kagetora. Kagetora full steam. Unless we're fighting some sort of like super cancer. We're fighting the Sakura 1. Tell you what, just in case it's not what I think it is, let me take Kuku Khan as my backup. But I'm gonna be functioning under the assumption that it is, in fact, 
some sort of moon cancer, probably a bead. All right, let's go. It'll be D D D D the BB to surpass C C C. Oh my god. Be fucking horrifying. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, that's pretty funny. Clearly, I should have frontlined Koko Khan instead. Oh, that's an evade on Tamamo. That's a buff block on Gaster. Oh, oh, whatever. Excuse me, uh, Mr. Kishinami, I'd like to take my turn at some point. Dude, he was playing fucking Yu-Gi-Oh over there. Okay, well, let's do this. Well, fetch me my cape and cane, boy. We're going out. Do I do that? No. Let's start with here. I right, go to assassinate Nero. Roll heads on the coin glove? Yeah, he did, piece of shit. Okay, Nero's fucking dead. We did it. I said it's going CCC, yep. I mean, to be fair, the school in CCC is modeled off the one in, uh, modeled off the one in Fuyuki. Oh, wait, no! Is it? Is the school in CCC different from the one in, uh, like, Vanilla Extra? It's a different school. What the fuck? Huh. It's pretty cool. All right, well, Tamamo's not really a threat. I'm just gonna ignore her. My one worry is that I am the single targeting these enemies. So whatever's in wave two might actually fuck me over. Oh, Tamamo stuns. Okay, it's not a pleasant surprise. Ah, for fuck's sake! They've divvied up the spoils between them. Dude Hakuno has all of the... Dude Hakuno has all the... has all the girls. Girl Hakuno's got all... The dick. Uh, do I CDR this? I think I do. 
I would very much like Gilgamesh to not get that off. Wait, how can those got Morgan voice? Oh, I didn't realize. No, I don't do damage! Wave 3? I bet in Wave 3 we fight like all the Sakura 5 at once. They didn't systematically destroy my stacks on Kagetora, did they? Okay, no, the invuln, the invuln was still there. Good. Okay. I'm kind of thinking we should assassinate Archer while we have him here. Like, Charlie is not really someone I can ignore indefinitely, but I feel like he's the least dangerous of these three. Okay, there goes Archer. I wonder how practical it is to AOE your way through this fight. I feel like you can do it. Oh, one of my buffs just got removed. Huh. Interesting. Okay, Charlie dies. What fucking planet am I in where Gilgamesh is the lowest priority? Uh, I'm not super keen on my damage on this one, but I also... Nah, you know what, let's just, let's just take him out. I don't think it's worth fucking around. Oh, we get some free shit. Cool. What's the catch? Okay, I think Dude Hakuno is a much bigger threat to my strategy. Oh god, you're right! My Kestorius can't actually survive this. Back to debate, uh, Kagetora has one baked in. I hope it comes up on time. Or in time, even. I should still have it left from Gilgamesh. I think. 
Whatever, this will stop their regular face guards. If I can at least get rid of one of them, I should be able to avoid dealing with disjointed entities. Yeah, I definitely feel like AoE is the way to go for this one. Got a gut? Oh no! Holy shit! They have a combo NP? Yo, that's cool. Uh, my front line's dead. That's a problem. So we have both on the field, okay. It seems like their damage went up as well. Oh well, it's fine. We got this. If we'll get that, surely we'll get it. I mean, th this is a showcase for it, and both are rollable. Or they're both are going to be rollable at some point, so I can only assume that we will in fact get it. I'm a little worried though, because I don't have a guts on this team. So if they NP again, I'm kind of fucked. Kugo has an evade? Uh, not that I know of. I have a guts for Jufu. Oh, that's not gonna work. Spend the stars on skill too. Oh, okay. Well. Hey, what's the wrong way? Oh, I've been working. I've been doing the ordeal call this entire time. Man, if only I'd run the bomb on Jufu. Ooh. That's unfortunate. Well, let's go! Uh, I could also play an NP, assuming he doesn't NP right away, but I kinda doubt it. Might be hosed? Yeah. What a way to go. So what I should probably do is to run Kugel Khan. Right burning shout, fuck you! That's a terrible reference, you should feel bad. For anyone wondering, Right Burning Shout is the name of uh That's the name of the OP for Fate Extra Last Encore.
No, I lost too many buffs. Damn, we were so close. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. For this next one, I'm bringing an Involm Pierce Servant. I'm bringing an Involm Pierce Servant. We're just gonna plow through the uh, the Servant traps. Or the Servant crap. We could use Space Arrest, that's an option. Yeah, unfortunate. Really bad timing on some of my skills. Okay, I'm up here so the second break doesn't matter. Her NP was the real problem all along. Think about this. Yeah. So we just need Invon Pierce. You established that Melusine does not, in fact, have it. Why done? Oh, the why done it was met. No, we've actually exhausted the wheel. I've actually, uh, I'm actually trying to think up some more goals to put up. Melusine third? Which Melusine? You're talking Lancer Melusine, right? No, I'm looking at my uh, rulers. Because I need a servant that can plow through the initial wave of... Um, plow through the initial wave of servants and still do effective damage to the Hakanos. Those are my primary concerns. A foreigner, I think, would do it, but I would need to get Involum Pierce going. Or no, maybe not. Kuku Khan has sure hit. So we lead with Koko Khan, I think. That's the play. Jekyll to 100? Alright, well, listen. that's That would end very badly for me. So yeah, well, let's lead with Koku. I feel like their health bar is... Uh... Yeah, you know what? Let's run that. Let's hedge our bets a little bit. So we do this, this is our leading edge, then we run someone to pair with um, Castoria as our real finisher. And I think that combination will do it. I want to avoid using Johanna, because I think Johanna is a trap on this one. If I use her, I'm kind of just setting myself up for failure, I think. So yeah, you know what? Here's our plan. I run Kagetora. Actually, no, you know what? Let's run Melusine. We run Melusine as the uh, the leading edge. And then we run Kagetora as the finisher, if one of them happens to survive. So our goal is to plow through with Kukul Khan, take as many of them out as possible, force the combo NP, and then finish them off with Melusine or something. Okay, slight problem with this plan. It's uh, my team's too expensive. So we could downgrade Koyan's CE. Do I even have her Bond CE somewhere? Maybe I do. Maybe it's in the shop. Not the shop, the... Uh, the what is that fucking thing called? The second archive. Maybe I could sort... Oh, no, I can sort by level. Level would give me all the 80s. So Koyans is a massive bow. Wrapped around the building. Okay, it's in my second archive. Whatever. Screw it. That's fine. We'll just do it this way instead. It's a... Uh, a very inelegant solution. But my party cost is quite tight. So I think I'm better off just... Wait a second. Chat. Chat, I'm about to do a very bad thing. Oh, 
All right, let's fucking go. Reject the modernity. Yeah, fuck it. Well, listen, gut still works against them. They can't purge it. He's got an evade. We just need to take out um, Hakunan first. You know what? It's confusing referring to them by Hakuno and Hakunan. I'm just going to call them by Elizabeth's nicknames. Which are, um... Piglet and Squirrel. Oh. What a fucking hand to draw on turn one. God damn it. What an absolutely useless end. This isn't gonna kill. I may have to reset again. Just because I failed to pull any Kugelkan cards. Oh, never mind! Okay, we did fail to kill Tamamo, though. Which is unfortunate, but... We can recover. Honestly, we just need this team to play for time. Once you get to the final wave. Alright, let's go. Uh, yeah, let's go for it. Okay, this is the important one to kill. Yes! Okay. Unfortunately, our damage has fallen just a tiny bit short both times. But honestly, I think I can probably live with it. Yeah, we just wait a turn, get all our shit back, and then go in on the Hakuno's next turn. I'm curious to see who will take this as an invitation to use, like, their, uh... Their signature servants. Which I guess I'm kind of doing in a manner of speaking, right? It's not like Kugel Khan is, like, the most suited servant for this fight. Okay, so the second break is the one I have to worry about. That's the one where it all goes to shit. Okay, 
Should I use that second buff? Uh, I probably could, honestly. Let's do it. Right a squad? Oh, dude, that'd be sick. I should do it, yeah. Okay, this is where we get our revenge. Let's just do this, get all our shit together. Actually, if we're gonna do this, I may as well do it this way. It doesn't matter that we use, uh, Quinn's guy's MP here, so I may as well. So your team here? Let me take a look. Yeah, it's a very U roster. I see Melt. I see Savior. Habanyan. Did I leave? I see. One million dead foxes. Ow. All right, let's fucking go. Full power, boys. Does Ignore Invincible not go through Evade? So, Invon Pierce does, but the Hakunos have a special one that only works against Anti-Enforcement and Invon, but not Evades. Okay, squirrel down, squirrel down. Alright. We just need the pig. You know what? Nah, let's do it this way. Take this. There we go. Holy shit. Huh. 
Holy fuck, a mission accomplished. God damn. Dude, today's like the showcase day for, um... For like, not quite turbo meta servants. That are still really fucking good. Now three hours of ember farming. I, were I only so fortunate as to be able to do this for three hours? Two grails! Let's fucking go. Gotta inflate the beeb? I do. I'm gonna be at this for a while. Oh, God. Oh, do we get it for class score? That's a good question. Hold on. Let's fucking do it. Oh, baby, show me the class score. Come on. Class score? Oh, what's class score? Class score is a series of buffs that apply to a specific class of servants. And you unlock them progressively as you go through a deal call. Oh. Oh. ゴールデンビービーです。これからは万能後輩女神系ヒロインとして活躍しますので、よろしくお願いしますね。先輩。There その気になれば月に海ぐらい作れます。プロテアのいたクレーターに水を流しただけですけど、今は私と先輩二人きりの月の浜辺です。あらあら、今更逃げるなんてできると思ってます？何の邪魔も誰の助けも入りません。でっか
Hold on. Let me crank this up. え、私の方を選んだんだ。よく無口で何を考えてるかわからないって言われるから、ちょっと意外。うん。嫌がってないよ。嬉しい。ムーンキャンサー、岸波白の。これから一緒に戦いましょう。勇ましいマスター君。Alright, Hakuno acquired. Oh god, that's another moon cancer I gotta level, huh? Alright, hold on. I mean, now we gotta do something else. There's one other thing we gotta do. Hold on. Come on. Come on. I must become the master of moon cancer. Yeah? いらっしゃいだね、マスター君。地道にコツコツやる。それとも盛大にリソースを使うのかな。Let's fucking go. Is that the swimsuit? What the fuck? Damn you, Takeuchi. I won't soon forget this. Oh, wrong one. There we go. The shielder class score is gonna fucking do that. Anyway. Oh, I guess it's 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 all the same. It's all one thing. Never mind. I was gonna say, imagine if each one of these was independent and you have to spec specifically into like shielder. Can you fucking imagine? Anyway, my first objective is to find the NP damage thing and get there ASAP. So that's it, that's the NP damage. There should be two of them, I think. Okay, so my primary moon cancer is a Buster Servant. So let's go down the Buster route down here. Uh-oh. I'm kind of short on some of these materials. Don't need all my mats. Those are the materials for all of extra one. Jesus Christ. Uh, actually. That's not abysmal. It's like, what, two servants worth? Actually, monument-wise, that's terrible. But for, like, non-monument materials? Ah. Uh, I could live with that. On my main account, I could. Probably not on JP. There we go. NP damage get. My sphere grid's looking pretty good. Okay, so there's like another NP damage over on the side that I need to get. So that's my next target. Well, yeah. I'm thinking... 
You've done pretty well. Okay, so chat. Now, I said I would stream until I got BB to level 118. Who here actually wants to see that? Oh, fuck. All right. Fine, hold on. You and break my you and break your promise? I'm thinking about it. Uh, listen, I've gotten I'm thinking about it. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Let's clear up some space. Okay, chat. Here's what I'm gonna do. Yes, cry. I'm, I'm gonna cry. Do I have enough QP to level her? Oh, fuck. He's got a point. He's got a point. Oh, my God. I gotta get from 103 to 118. Alright, see so you your Absol. Okay, you know what, chat? I'm gonna do something I normally don't do. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to reveal, I'm going to reveal us some secret sauce. Because there's no way I'm going to manually farm a BB to 120. 118, 118. You know what's the worst thing? I can't even promise that I'll have all of BB's materials for like next session and we do it all at once. For the simple reason that it's physically impossible to have enough embers in your inventory to do that. Alright, well... Tell you what, chat. Hold on. I'm gonna pull up an illusion. Oh, it's not an illusion. That's a uh, Do You Remember Starbucks? Space Bucks. All right, chat. Let's fucking go. How many of these do I have? I have 35 silvers. All right, let's start there. Give me a second. I'll, I'll, I'll show the screen in a minute. Ooh, spooky. Spooky play button in the corner. <laughs> All right, chat, you asked for it. Let's fucking go. It's a very mysterious, uh, it's a mysterious force. Actually, hold on. See you, Minos. Time to start Genjin? I probably should. Okay, I need to cover that. The, I need to cover that corner. Okay, 
Perfect. Fucking seamless. My deception is complete. Okay, Jack, you know what? You guys may, may as well have some fun with this. Give me a sec. Tell you what, I can't promise I'll get all the way to 118 because that might be a multi hour affair. But I can do this. Okay, four hours, I'm doing it. Golden BB? You know what? Good idea. Hold on. You know what breaks plausible deniability? <laughs> that coming up. Okay, let's go. All right, chat. All right, the gates are open. You want to put stuff in the queue? Go for it. You cute BB channel is your first thing? Okay, well, I feel like it's only appropriate that we celebrate uh, with a word from our good friend, uh, Shiro Archer Emiya. There we go. Perfect. That's definitely Shiro. And not someone who should be paying more attention in traffic. I really do need to look into the source of that. That's so annoying. It's FGA that's doing it? Oh. Where the fuck's are trying to notify me? Oh, maybe it's for an update. Alright, hold on. You know, we never did figure out what Cosmo Drops deal was. Well, maybe we did in the story, but I skipped all of it. Eh, mystery for another day. All right, give me a second. Oh, you want to see something cursed here? Let me put up this shroud. This is the price of taking responsibility.
Oh, wow, this thing doesn't really have a turn off notifications thing, huh? Hmm. Disable notifications. Now, how'd you do that? Like an options thing? Oh, I can turn off notifications. Okay. Maybe that'll do. Here, let's try it. Target level 118. You know what, Chad? I may as well show you the, the wonders and horrors of my Curse Catalyst folders. Some of these are unsorted, so they're a little rough around the edges. Let's see what I got this month. Oh, hey. Here's one for daily disappointments. All right. Trong might with a skip the current song. You have to turn notifications. You, in, you go into your actual phone settings. Or emulator, like, uh, emulator phone settings. You go to notifications. You turn on notifications specifically for FGA. Uh, third hand. Oh, dude, I gotta show you guys something. There's a, a new design that got introduced in Nikkei recently. I gotta say, it might be up my alley. Look at this. She's like a walking red flag. And he does be, I, she sounds like Yukobayashi. I don't know if the voice actress has been confirmed, but it does sound like her. Can she break you? Oh, yeah, she can. Uh, 100%. Also, dude, this line came up in the story and I immediately thought, I immediately thought of Gundam. Typically, the first iteration of any model is incredibly strong, especially prototypes. Like, I know there's in-universe justifications for it. But 
but like... It always is funny to me that instead of making more of the Gundam that's winning the war, invariably everyone decides to make the Gundam but shit. Oh, dude, here's a good one. The Tennessee Titans former CEO has a beard and mustache that makes him look like Bane's, like Bane's face mask. Looks like the one. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. So I know who you're talking about. Hold on. Hold on. I know exactly who you're talking about. God, dude. Incredible. Well, listen, if they ever make a live action movie based on Gen 5, they know who to get. Let's see what else I got. Oh, I met this player in, uh, in Master Duel a few weeks back. It's everyone's favorite Lopperid, in Dingwei. <laughs> Evidently, Run It Down Midway was a little too long-winded. See what else I got. All right, have a good one, Breaker. Thanks for stopping by, good sir. Oh, here's a good one. Yeah, it's a skill drive. Ah, oh, you know it is. In the grind. See what I got. It's been a while since I've done an impromptu 24 hour stream, huh? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, 
Okay, I think I showed this one on stream before, but this one fucking got me. If you think Baron of all things is unfair, pretty much any modern boss monster is broken. I wouldn't mind seeing a band to Baron in Appaloosa, but not because they're unfair. Unreal. What else we got? I caused chaos and destruction when I told everyone Master called me best girl. Good old Corundum. No, we're done. Now I'm just grinding up uh, BB. Oh, hold on. I got some etch on. But isn't eating everything a little too much? You're banned from eating snacks. Oh, yo. Actually, while well, I was looking up stuff for the Gacha Game Roulette, I don't know if I show this on stream. But I looked up a Black Lagoon gacha game, and it looks like this. That's just what I want from Black Lagoon. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. What is this song that's playing right now? Is it Fire Emblem? Oh, it is. happening it's a fucking racket in the sky ah oh, classic no more boozing Oh yeah, here's a good one. You know how like the uh, the generic thing is that people, you know, people go, oh no, the Dreamcast was so many years ago. I feel old. Here's how I. Here's what like. Here's my I feel old moment. Fucking AI. I don't know if it's actually AI, but I'm assuming AI movie recap channels have re fucking recapped RoboCop. Because it's something that they assume people haven't already seen. Which Robocop? Take a guess.
Oh, here's a fun thing. Back when I was doing a little research into uh, Scholar of the First Sin, I thought, oh, this item is cool. How do I get the upgrade? Invade a random world as Dark Spirit and defeat the host player 1,000 times. Nah, I'm good. It's the easiest game to pull us off, really? Defeating like a thousand hosts? Holy shit. Wait, phase on. Your moment was someone asking you what dial up meant? Holy shit. Uh, okay. I spent an embarrassing amount of time trying to reach this fucking trash can back when the Hina event was running. Because every other fucking trash can in this event is interactable. And there's something in it. I thought, oh, maybe by coming during a specific day, the boxes won't be there. Oh, maybe if I use strength, I can move the boxes. And get access to the trash can. <laughs> That you can get Mew? Uh, dude, so I'm convinced that either that either Mew is in that trash can or that's where they keep all of Jury's pancakes. And the boxes are just there for our protection. Nerf healing in DS2, PvP ends quickly. Oh, okay. Do people not just like chug life gems in DS2 PvP? Or is it just that they're less effective? Oh my god. They heal you over 60 seconds, I see. When I was alone worrying, a certain heroic spirit gave it to me. I had no idea how to approach a guy. I'll give you this elixir. When you go to Master's room, please drink this. Your trouble should vanish. What did he mean by this? Oh. I finally saved up 2 billion QP. With this much, I should be good for the rest of the year. Oh, I was like this once. Listen, when you're in a lottery, 2 billion QP sounds like a drop in the bucket. But the second you want to... The second you really want to go ape shit, it dries up in an instant.
Servant Hub is a pirated website full of videos that don't meet the community guideline standards of the uploading website Servant to. This is one of such videos. Ah, here's a favorite of mine. What was Senpai doing? I will say that forehead looks pretty familiar. Oh, wait, hold on. I have a perfect image for today. You've turned the tables on BB. Do you know which one the Servant Hub one comes from? Oh, um, I don't think I do. I can kind of try and infer it from context. It was one of the... Um, it's, a, it's related to an Arctic Summer World Servant. It is between the Wu and the Ibuki section of this uh, screen cap list chronologically. So I can only assume it's... It's either Ibuki or Wu. Oh, the face the Valkyries make when they tell you that there is no rerun of Arctic Summer World. Yo. I fucking hate that game. What is this video? The fuck? Oh god, chat. I mean, I'm only I I'm only so fortunate. I'm only so fortunate that like uh, I don't have to manually farm this shit. But good fucking lord. I'm in I'm in trouble. Oh. <laughs> 
I don't know, chat. Maybe I should go look up uh, Just World Hypothesis for the PS2. Is gold, of gold BB? Actually, that's a good question. I think I haven't set it to random. But hold on. Yeah, we could actually do that. Hold on. You know what? You make a good point. Oh, speaking of which, uh, if I don't fuck everything up between uh, today and now, or between today and then, this coming Friday is going to be the PS2 Nostalgia Roulette. I have all the games for it, I just need to get the OSSC uh, up and running. So look forward to that. I got some, I got some fucking good shit from back in the day. I've also got some really bad shit. Listen, if I ever feel like being miserable, one of these days I'll play a Tales of Legendia on stream. I fucking hate that game. Like Nocturne? Nah. No thanks, bro. Eternal Ring? God, why? Oh, well, I probably shouldn't have shown that, but whatever. Who gives a fuck? It's like, it's, it's past midnight. I don't give a fuck anymore. I'm like a gremlin. I FGA'd after midnight. Any Jack Rex or Sly? I don't know if it's going to be on the uh, Nostalgia Wheel. But I actually do have a bunch of uh, PS2 era Jack and Daxter and uh, Ratchet games. A couple of Sly ones as well. I was really a Ratchet kind of guy. I really enjoyed those games. Like, I'd say the first three are like some fucking peak shit. People, people like Deadlocked. I'm kind of lukewarm on it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Did I ever play Zone of the Enders? No, not on stream. I played the, the original game briefly in my own time. Yeah, I'll say, like, I think the Ratchet 2, like, um, what is it? Going Commando is probably, I, yeah, like, I think if I had to pick, like, the best 3D action platformer, I would go with that one, just off the top of my head. Just in terms of how, like, um, just how well it sort of strikes the balance with all the random shit it's got going on. Hey, it seems like incredible for 03. Oh, you mean Zone of the Enders? Yeah. I remember that kind of a rep back in the day. It's the game that people bought just to get the demo for uh, MGS2. Which they, they, they then got debated by. Because that was actually, uh... What, the only part of that game you play is Solid Snake? That was fucking funny. Oh, hold on. Guys. Here is a... Uh, here's a POV shot. This one is a mock-up they did for uh, what would have happened if they got to Ordeal Call 3 on FGO Arcade. 
Look at these realistic graphics. <laughs> I want to sleep. No, sleep is for the week. Gives you the water arco eyes. Costco exists in the Tsukihime remake continuity? That's hilarious. Take responsibility for my ass. This episode, the writer is rarely disguised fetish. <laughs> yes, beautiful. You know what? Yeah, let's just keep that on the screen permanently. Why the fuck not? Perfect. How could this happen? Can't bullshit me. I have no choice but to take responsibility. I've been cornered. <laughs> Soma. <laughs> look, look what I found. Dude, I would be shocked if the actual duel between them in game didn't end with a knife fight. Was it from Lost Belt 6? I believe so, yeah.
対象の私もちろん見たいですか気づきましたかここは私のドレスなので逃げ場はどこにもありません夢見るように砂の中で眠りなさいわはは邪魔見ろおー、いっぱいくさんくるべん。Let's do it. Let's take a look. Oh, interesting. I don't know if I should say. I do have something to say about that, but I probably shouldn't say it. Who the fuck in the series is actually here right now? Zerk is, I guess. Well, I guess I'll say this much. Fortunately for me, I've already gotten everything I need to out of that card. So I'm happy to see it go. What'd you miss? Oh, Chong Mai's talking about his uh, ban list pick. Check the M's. Oh, let's take a look. <laughs> ah, this glorious. Glorious meme. Two years of specimens came out with a glopping noise. I see, so this is the fabled Merlin Magecraft. To be fair, telling Castoria to mix specimen and gunpowder is a very uh, quote unquote Merlin thing to say. I, c I could picture that Merlin saying it. That chill be an annual thing? Maybe, yeah. I don't know if we get in enough new hats year by year for it, but I wouldn't be opposed. All the new hats? Yeah, that, that could work. Absolutely. I don't know if I could promise that I could make a specific stream out of uh, this or that. For the simple reason that my schedule is an atrocity right now. I am actually gaining goals faster than I can clear them. Oh my god, here's a fucking throwback. Dude, this folder goes back a ways. Holy shit. <laughs> Let's 
play Danmaku shooting game. Hold shift for focused movement. Yo, this reminded me. Listen, I, it might be a nightmare to set up, but if if there's a way of doing it, I would love to do Soul Calibur 2 next time. In the uh, for the fighting game slot for the circuit. Fight Kate? Maybe. I'd have to look into it. No, 2's not the one with Vader. So, um, Soul Calibur 4 had Darth Vader, Yoda, and um, Star Killer? 3 didn't have any crossover characters, but you could make uh, create a character Cosmos. Two had uh, Spawn for Xbox, Heihachi for PS2, and um, Link for GameCube. I'm gonna make an announcement. Fino Tyson is a bitch. Oh my, my god! Over my fucking wife. That's right. He took his stinky streamer curse out and cursed all over my wife. You. And he said his wallet was this big, and I said that's disgusting. Which one is he? I think that may have been five. I, I've never played five. Thank you for the $310 soon. I'm sorry you can't keep up with your goals. Anyways, I'm adding Jormungan Season 1. I wonder how well it holds up today. So, first of all, thank you very, very much soon for the $310. And, of course, Jormungan, you got it. Uh, bad news for me is that technically counts for the BB Grill thing. <laughs> Which means we're going, we're going the fucking distance. Oh, God. Oh god. You know what I'm thinking? Maybe there's a team that could clear this even faster. Like if I don't go for bond efficiency, I go for raw speed. Maybe I could make something happen. I like how technically this counts as being met on the 23rd. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Here forever. I mean, I don't have plans for tomorrow, but I was hoping to get that rolling guy done tonight. Or last night. Triple scope? Honestly, may not be the worst idea. I'd have to redo my uh, third hand. Oh, what the fuck? Does she always do the evil eyes? It's terrifying. Turn a Gundam. Yeah, you're Master-kun. Is Golden BB like Golden Freddy? Wait, are the entirety of her fucking wings modeled? Look at that! Fucking look at that! Her fucking... It's so fucking wide that it, it gets shoved out at the start. Look, hold on. You just noticed? Yeah, take a guess. I've been leveling BB in her second ascension this entire time.
Holy shit, dude. You know what this reminds me of? Hey, if, if you ever want to give your browser a bad time, try looking up Mnemosyne's, like, full sprite in-game. The actual sprite for Mnemosyne is fucking... or Mnemosyne, rather, is colossal. It is unreal big. Why did they need the entire thing modeled? Who the fuck knows? Okay, chat. 106. Check DMs? Sure thing. Let me just check something real quick. To make sure I'm not fucking myself. So, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So we need 8. 8 times 30. Okay, no, never mind. I have to keep using B for at least one more level. I'm five servant coins short. Unless there's one here. But BB came out after the change, so I don't believe that's the case. Let's just pick those up. Yeah, here, let me just get the Doomsday Machine spinning again. You know, we can expedite the process, though. What is this? <laughs> so much. Uh... I printed my grails? Yep, I already have. Grails have been casted. My god, Soma. Come on, fuck you! 1v1 me, I've mastered pure London Magecraft, no bolus. It's a fucking incredible. <laughs> Okay, so let's say I want to run a pure farming team. Let's say I commit team uh, team four to that. What would a raw, pure speed farming team look like? So we run two AoEs in a single target with no swap. That's the ideal. Okay, so Paul Bunyan... I don't have Super Bunyan in this account, I think. Oh no, I do! But she fucking sucks. Never mind. Also, I wouldn't want Super Bunyan against the Night Class in case I draw one. So that's out. I could use Draco, honestly. If we're gonna run Triple Scope, I could go Paul Bunyan, Draco. Because Draco will have advantage against literally everything we fight. With a fast NP? Okay, I think I can make something work there. Okay, we're going for speed. How many case ghosts do I have? Oh, that's a problem. Cope scope? I that's a good question. Do I have a limit broken cope scope? <laughs> I the my sheer misfortune of having only pulled three cope scopes this entire time.
That's fine. We just need to run... I just need to run someone that has a 20% battery. Or 20% uh, charge up end. A little unfortunate, but... Mordred? Uh, we might run into assassins. That might cause some problems. Oh, does my shitty Lancelot have his append? <laughs> nope. What a pain in my ass. I couldn't need a Grizz, but that doesn't really save me all that much time. Does my Riku have her up in? No. Does my Beeb have her up in? Kinda. You know what? Hold on. Two words with one stone. Give me a second. Oh yeah, let's also do this. I don't actually know if um, Ascension 1 Nero is faster than Ascension... than Ascension 3, but I, I think that's the case. We're going for pure speed on this one. Raw Connie power. Oh, shit! I fucking hate... I fucking hate... I hate caster gems. They're out of caster gems. Are casters even on tap right now? I don't think they are. Dude, gold caster gems are the bane of my fucking existence in this game. No, it's an archer day. Shit. Man, why do they gotta make this so hard for me? You know what? I'll say this. We actually saw the uh, Code Geass uh, Resurrection movie on uh, Thursday. It's quite good. I enjoyed it. You know, it's very fan service -y, but that's to be expected. Triple K scope? Dude, I'm trying, but like, there is no third scope. Or my third scope is non-limit broken. Wait a second. Because I need to, I need to remove the, every button press from this encounter. So I need to actually find a servant that has their second append maxed out. Oh, that's her third append. Shit. What the fuck is she goes since third append? All right, you know what? We'll Melusine for the time being. Melusine is not fast at all. But I don't really see a great alternative right now. Can't I move my pens around? I thought they said that's a thing they were going to do, but they haven't done it yet. Unless I'm mistaken. Okay, we also need to get a little cheeky with our bond on this one. 
Let me do it this way. Because I need to get it so that my BB bonds up. Okay, so let's see how this works. Yeah, they said they were intending to do it, but I don't believe it's a thing currently. Unfortunately. Alright, chat. We got... The Dork Squad. Clappable? It's true. Oh, okay, Melcine's out. Fuck. I need to audit my Berserkers and see... I need to see if any of my Berserkers have, uh... Oh, God! No, pure scopes are just not... They're just not gonna work. I have to actually input some sort of damage in this process. If I swap to, like, a second Buster Servant, I can use... Shh, fuck me, we're not even close. Oh, that's true. The Nightbot Misers, that's a fair point. Okay, well, that experiment's a dismal failure. You know, I need to see if the BB is very close or very far from actually hitting that servant coin total. Yeah, honestly, I'm probably better off just sticking with the BB. Like, if this were a main, I could just use, like, Raikou Kintoki or something. But unfortunately, I don't have quite that kind of firepower. Do the lottery thing where you use all your resources just to make your farming more efficient. Hey, I've been there. I've absolutely been there. Yeah, it's just not going to work. All right, let me check this. Oh, actually, okay. We will have enough servant coins. That's good. I may as well do this while I have these servants available. And eh, never mind, screw it. Actually, this is what I should probably do. All right, well, let's keep going. The game is afoot, lads. Ah. Help me. Oh, 
<laughs> My brain is melting. Oh, yo, chat, check this out. My editor skips all the side quests in Yakuza 0. I have no choice but to kill them. Is this 120 regular BB? So, I'm not gonna say no, but I also can't promise I'll be able to do that anytime soon just because I don't have the grails for it. Because we're like, what, plus one grail right now? Everything else is committed to, uh, committed to this BB. So just for pure logistical reasons, I probably can't do it anytime soon. Unless I do it on main. No, never. No, never. Fuck that. Keep on the back of my head. You're grailing EO to 120? Damn! What inspired this? You have a 120 Summer Kama and you plan to 120 Summer Mellow? Yeah! EO seems like a peculiar choice. Uh, logistically speaking, anyway. For the full Himiko package? Ah, I see. Oh, yo. I should have pulled this out for the T event. <laughs> Yo, 
<laughs> what I would do for this game to have a fucking skip function. Like a civilized gacha game. How's the energy level? The plummeting, dude. It's hitting me. Like, in a 24-hour stream, this would be around the time where I start crashing. Ah, oh, there we go. Here's a mood. No, uh, listen, Nico. If I... If I take a nap... It's, I'm gonna wake up at like 8 in the morning. The second I, like the second I let my guard down, it's over. Like it's gonna be, it's gonna be 7 hours later or something. Wait a second. Seamless. You draw Morgan all beautiful and pretty, yet draw Castoria like a fucking gremlin? That is true, Soma. Perhaps that implies the existence of a gremlin Morgan. Oh, what's this? Oh!
Nice. Big Morg is back in town. Yeah, it's a good looking Morgan. Well, listen, I think it only makes sense, right? Because Morgan's been around for a lot longer. And um, she's sort of grown out of her gremlin phase. But judging by her judging by her backstory and her animations, it's abundantly clear that she spent some amount of time as a gremlin that put all her points into int, but went around bashing things to death with a sword anyway. Listen, man, her sword is in scaling and she is going to use it. Ah, oh, so that's a classic. I will not be the bigger person. I am 5 0. Explode. Did Sephiroth do this? <laughs> Wait, oh, you reminded me of something. Hold on. Mood of the hour. Let's see, what is this? <laughs> nice. I 
Alright, have a good one, Strong Mai. God, oh man. What the fuck? There's 123 of you still here? It's 108 on a Monday. What are you. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, you're on the night shift, that's right. Your schedule doesn't exist. Some people have passed out with the stream on, probably, yeah. Sleep at 10 a.m. QP? Jesus Christ. Thought you're sick and woke up at 5 p.m.? Fucking hell. では、祝福と殺害を開始。少しだけ本気になります。夢見るように砂の中で眠りなさい。逃げ場がどこにもありません。夢見るように砂の中で眠りなさい。カット。最初のもちろん見たいですか。傷しましたか。Oh, man. <laughs> it's a fucking... 
Absolute classic. I feel like a wreck, chat. How are you guys holding up? Am I enjoying my newest, shiniest BB? No. I mean, taking a pound town by Biebs. Well, 45 minutes till the ZZZ event ends? Oh, good luck. Damn. Senpai? Are you feeling okay? Should I hit you with a bunker bolt? Oh, let's see, Saul. Let me take a look. I thought being Asian was bad until I took this? What the fuck? Okay, we got it. We got the BB coins. Is 
In the old days of feudal Japan, a samurai warrior would shout, You are trying to view Flash content, but you have no Flash plugin installed. Yo, here's a crazy one. I don't know if any of you guys have read this. I don't actually know what the source is, but like, damn. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, chat. One second. Perfect. <laughs> oh, let me check somewhere. Oh, my God. So, you've outdone yourself with this one. Won't go, mate. It's <laughs> beautiful. You know, after she was known as Ash the Witch, but before she was known as Ash the, Sa Ash the Savior, she made a name for herself as Ash the Gremlin. Just imagine, like, Ash squaring up against someone and then going, Behold, I will show you my magecraft. This is the magic missile. Then she just fucking flicks a sword at you. If you think about it, Avalon Le Fay Magecraft is really just a very long game of sticks and stones. It's all knives and explosives. Oh, 
You know be the worst stream ever? Me setting the third hand to use 99 gold apples and going to sleep. <laughs> That'd be terrible. I'm not going to do that for a number of reasons. But one of them is that this game will absolutely crash if I do that at some point. Then it'll really be the worst stream ever. In the Atelier series, one of the magic items you can craft to use in battle is a magic sword to throw. And so on the next level, that's pretty cool. Oh, we would home screen? Okay. Man, I don't know how people do it. I can feel my voice going. Just for being up for so long. You know, I pro pro Golden BB probably has a really fast, or sorry, a really slow NP animation. Or maybe it's not actually slower, I don't know. I feel like it's slower. Good afternoon! Oh, good morning to you. Alright, Beebs, show me show me with the last like what? Half hour of farming? Ooh, please. Just a few hundred more of those. I'm begging you, Beebs. Take pity on a poor man like me. Damn it, Beebs. Please. <gasps> okay, a great suck. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm mean, sure that we can get to 105 at least. Come on. Oh, two greats. Okay. We got. All right. Have a good one, Zerk. Thanks for coming, dude. Saving for Oberon, Koi, and Tiamat. Not a bad selection. We did it. Oh, 
super. Oh, look at that progress. Beautiful. Alas. Okay, chat. Tell you what. I'm going to be a coward. I'll be a coward and a traitor and uh, a little weasel. But as penance for not doing it all on video, I will have my third hand farm this relentlessly until Beebs is ready. However, as penance for my betrayal, I have an idea. Three ten rolls. I will offer one to the Beeb for no reason. There is zero benefit to me doing this. That is my penance. I'll do that one last. Two to Passion Lip. Two to Passion Lip, one to Beebs. You guys ready? Let's go. It's a servant. Come on. Alter ego. Yes. And before passion lib. And before passion lib. Hell yeah. I'm pretty happy about that. All right, no, one more. This one, also the passion lip. Oh, a go see. My first one, interesting. Oh my God. Yo! Are you guys seeing this shit? NB5 Passion Lip, we did it! Okay! That is NB... Look at this roll, dude! God damn! It's like the god roll. Actually, hold on, chat. If I'm gonna brag about this roll, I may as well uh, take a proper screen cap. One without, uh, one without incriminating evidence in the bottom left-hand corner. Give me a second. All right, there we go. Okay, chat. Now for the final roll. I'll do this as a slow one. This is my offering to the beep. I gotta pay my respects. Still though, damn. I believe we've hit uh, NP5 Passion Lip with that. So I'm pretty happy about that. With the case scope, no less. No beebs, no beebs, don't curse me, no beebs.
the one time I want to get spooked. It's the principle of the thing, right? I don't want to give BB the last word. But it is my responsibility as a good, upstanding streamer to tempt fate. Is it over? No, it's not over. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Dodge it. Dodge the beam. Don't let her NP7 you. It is over. Okay, we dodged it. Beeb dodged. I am safe. I am pure. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed tonight's entertainment. Before I let you off into the wilderness, though, let me uh, do a little bit of a check on what I've got planned for this week. So, um, Wednesday, I'm going to be doing Zero Time Dilemma. It should be the finale for that. Uh, Thursday, I'm going to be doing Monogatari Season 2 Part 2 as a movie night. Friday should be the PS2 Nostalgia Roulette, although I have to check some technical stuff on that. Saturday is going to be the Age of Mythology Zerk Royale, or it's a tournament, really, as part of the Universal Mages Circuit. And Sunday's going to be Fate Grand Order, so look forward to that, everyone. Thank you very much for sticking with me to this ungodly hour. And I hope you all have a good week, and I'll see you next time, everyone. Peace out.